Hey guys, Josh here, and welcome to Little Dragon's Cafe. I'm still one minute early, so just gonna wait a little bit until 3 p.m. until people can join us and everything. Hope you guys are doing good today. I've been wanting to play this game for a little while, so... If you guys don't know, Little Dragon's Cafe came out for the Nintendo Switch in 2018. So it's been like three or four years now, and I don't know why I never played it. Well, actually, I know why. Um, because a lot of the reviews when this game came out were kind of negative or mixed. Uh, some people said the game was really fun, really addictive, uh, had really interesting characters. But also a lot of people said that there was so many bugs and like it didn't look too good. There was frame rate issues, so... And the game was like, in Canadian dollars, was like 70 or... It was like a full price game. So it was quite expensive, but I got it on Amazon a few days ago. It was, well, a week ago actually. And it was 50% off, so I got it for like $40. So I think that was a fair price. So yeah, I've had this game for over a week now and I've been anxiously waiting to play and I want to know if I'm gonna like it or not because it seems to be very divisive either people like it or don't like it so I've been wanting to play and I've been waiting because I wanted to experience it with everybody here so so yeah I'm gonna be doing that today so I'm <laughs> really really excited I uh, hope you guys are good there's already 50 people I uh, hope you guys are all good today I usually don't stream at this time so hopefully people who can't usually catch the live stream maybe they're gonna be able to catch the live stream today since it's kind of a different time zone um, different time than usual uh, if the audio if you can't hear me or if the music is too loud as usual just let me know hi Melanie Judith Rose Liz Nani me Natalia hope you're good Little Dragon's Cafe is cute. Yeah, it does look so cute, and I can't wait to play. Hi, Josh. I've only played about 30 minutes of this. Couldn't get into it, but maybe it'll change my mind. So that's the thing, right? I've always hear people, like, they either really get into it and they love it, or they can't get into it. So let's see what's gonna happen with me. Uh, hopefully, I'm gonna like it. I really want to like this game. It's actually being made by... It's being produced by Yasuhiro Wada, who worked who produced the first Harvest Moon games. So that's one of the reasons why I really want to play it. Hi, Malinda. First live stream I have been able to catch up this game and I really liked it. See, well, I'm glad you liked it and hopefully I'm gonna like it as well. Hi, Beatrice. Hi, Elster El Shaman. Shaman. I'm excited because it's late enough that I'm home from work and early enough that I'm not really sleepy. Yeah, that's why I like to like stream sometimes at a different time zone so it can accommodate People who can't usually, like, catch the streams. Um, Veronica, I'm excited to see this. I heard similar reviews, so I waited. Yeah, exactly. So hopefully you guys can make up your mind if you are undecided about this game. Um, hello, everyone. Hi, Leptail. Long time to see. Hope you're doing good. Your voice sounds muffled. Oh, do I sound muffled? Hmm... Is it because the audio of the game is too loud? Is it better like this? Hi Josh, hi Victoria, hope you're doing good. You sound regular to me, not really in my opinion, you're good. Okay. I played a decent amount of this one, but the controls, especially jumping, made it hard for me. Oh no. Maybe there's been some updates. So we're on version 1.0.3, so there's been like three updates since 2018. So I don't think there's been too many updates, unfortunately. Uh, I can hear you fine. Okay. Well, I'm glad you guys can hear me. So let's start, because actually I changed my setup a little bit. Um, I bought a new desk. Uh, maybe we can talk about that later, but I bought a new desk. So my whole setup is moved. So I don't know if I sound different than usual. Um... The game audio, yeah, maybe I can just lower the game audio a tiny little bit. Alright, so you can choose whether you want to play as a boy or a girl. So we're gonna pick the boy. There's so many people today, you guys are so active on the chat. I feel like I feel like it's been <laughs> such a long time there's a lot of people uh, on the chat, on the streams. What's your helper's name? So we're gonna keep her name as Rin. So let's start. 
Is this on the Switch? Yes, it is on the Switch. Uh, I think it's also available on PS4. It's also available on Steam. But I'm playing on the Switch version, and apparently the PS4 version, probably PC as well, run a little bit smoother. This game looks so cute. It's not like the most impressive game graphically, but the art style, it's kind of like... If you look at the texture, it's kind of like hand-drawn, kind of like... It looks like it was made with like color pencils or something. So I think that's an interesting art style. Looks like kind of like scribbles. Yeah. And so yeah, in this game you have a dragon, which is why it's called Little Dragon's Cafe. And you have to manage a cafe. And as you play, your dragon is going to grow into a bigger dragon. And the more, like, I know later you can, like, fly on your dragon and explore more areas. But apparently the first area is pretty small. Yeah, that house, the cafe is really cute. I have it on PS4. Someone gave it to me as a gift, but I never played it. Oh, you should, you know what? If you can play it right now, you should play. Yeah, look at this. Like, it looks like a storybook or something, right? Morning, did you sleep okay? I'm sure mom's already awake. Let's go downstairs to the kitchen. Lots of loading screens so far, uh, but I mean, it's the beginning where there's, like, there's lots of cutscenes and stuff. Cafe general controls. Use the left stick to move, hold the L button and tilt the left stick to walk, talk to people or examine items with A. So you can, uh, yeah, you can run with L. There's kind of like, it's kind of stuttering a little bit, but I think it's just like the style. I don't know. And then you can walk. So let's go into mom's room. Oh, she's not here. Yeah, this looks so cute. So you can't move the camera. It's just like, yeah, the camera is just like fixed. Yeah, it really does feel like I'm in a storybook, like a fairy tale. Resolution looks a little blurry. Is that normal? I think it might change sometimes depending on the the connection but I don't think I don't know if it's blurry for other people but I don't think it looks blurry I don't think it should be blurry this looks so cute okay all right so let's go check let's go check our sister oh wow lots of stuff here okay all right let's go check our sister oh let's go to the one floor first floor Good morning, mom. Hey there, sleepyheads. I'm glad you're awake. It looks beautiful outside. You know what? You know what that means, right? I'm sure we'll have lots of customers on a day as nice as this. Can I ask my two favorite helpers to give me a hand in the kitchen? Of course, we're ready to help. Thank you. Can you go out to the backyard and bring me three eggs? I'm sure we have some fresh eggs waiting for us out there, thanks to the egg bird. Once you have them, go ahead and put them in the food storage, okay? I wonder what's an egg bird, is that just a chick? I feel like all birds are egg birds, so <laughs> I'm looking forward to seeing what kind of... Is it just gonna be a regular chicken or something? So let's go to the backyard. My video defaulted to 144p. Oh no, <laughs> for some reason, I had to change it manually. Yeah, sometimes YouTube does that, right? Um, you will change into the adventurer's clothes out on the field. There you can gather ingredients for dishes and recipes needed for changing. Oh, it's interesting. So you change your outfit when you go outside. Use the B button to jump. If you encounter a ledge that is shorter than you, jump over it. So someone earlier said the jump was not good, right? Or something. So, all right, you can jump. All right, so let's go see the egg bird. Oh, yeah, it's not exactly a chicken. It's kind of like a chicken. Eggs and egg birds. The egg birds around the cafe will produce one egg every morning. They look like... They look like they're made out of, like, 
fabric or something. They look like not a real bird, right? White egg. White egg. White egg. This is okay. What happens if you, okay, you can't <laughs> you can't uh, jump into the water. This looks so lovely, so cute. So you can move the camera around outside. It's just inside that there's no camera rotation. Maybe we should take a walk. Um Let's see if there's anything we can explore. I shouldn't wander too far. Okay, so let's just bring the egg to our mom and let's cook a little something. There's a little seagull flying. This is so cute. All right, okay, let's go in. Let's not waste too much time. Looks like they wrapped their watercolor pencil-like texture that's common in children's book on top of the models and backgrounds to give the children's story and fairytale aesthetic. Yeah, exactly, right? I think th I think that does look pretty good. Uh, return to the cafes to move your ingredients to food storage. Ingredients are used from food storage. Check stocked ingredients whenever food storage is examined. Okay. Oh, there, there, there's a joke box here. I wonder if you can change the music maybe later. <laughs> I can see in the. I think that's the wash. Yeah, I think that's the bathroom. You can't go. You, well, you can go in there, but you can't see in there. Okay, so let's talk to mommy. Lots of loading screens. For every gamer moment, what happened if you <laughs> casually try jumping down the cliff? Yeah. I think there's combat also in this game, so you can die, but yeah, you can't jump into the water. Great job, you two. What fresh eggs? Next. Welcome, please have a seat. Thank you. Well now, Josh, would you be a dear and take the order from the customer? I'm certain the customer is waiting to place an order. Yeah, let's go check our customer. So I think in this game, every chapter, there's gonna be like a different customer and you're gonna have to help them solve their problem in some way. So an icon is displayed on customers who are waiting for their orders to be taken. Place the orders taken next to the kitchen. Hey, hey. All right, so gonna place his order here. Okay, so he ordered a sunny side up. We should go ahead and use those fresh eggs you got me earlier. Say, Josh, why don't you make it? <gasps> huh? Why aren't you making it? Oh, I just think it would be nice for the experience. Well, come on. All right, let's make some sunny side up. Josh, can you handle it? Yes, of course. And another loading screen. At least they're not too long, but there's, <laughs> there's a lot. Choose a recipe and select the ingredients to start cooking. Once cooking is started, ingredients will appear on the screen. Oh yeah, so there's some kind of rhythm game, I think, um, when you want to cook something. So sunny side up, cooking temperature warm required. Egg result, none comments, none. Are you a salt or pepper kind of person or both? You guys let me know. I think I'm more a pepper kind of person, personally. All right, let's cook this. Oops, oh, okay. <laughs> so you have to press like Y, X, B, and A. I was trying to do it with the thumbstick, but. Oh, wow, oh, wow, that was easy. Rich, slightly sweet, sunny side up. This success depends on the ingredient rank and the result of a rhythm action. The taste also changes depending on the combination of the ingredients used. Have fun today, Josh. Thank you so much, Burife. I hope you have fun as well today. I like the egg by itself. It doesn't need anything more. You know what, actually, most of the time when I eat eggs, I don't add <laughs> too much salt or pepper. Have you been practicing? Actually, no. Okay, can you, oops. Did you get that, Josh? Make sure you don't drop it. I like that the food is actually like 2D. It's just like a drawing instead of like a 3D model. Dishes that have been cooked are placed in front of the kitchen. An icon will be displayed above the customer waiting for their order. All right, so let's place, let's serve this. Here you are. Eggs need butter, at least that will give it a little... Oh, I never thought about putting butter on the egg. 
Thank you, you did great serving that customer. Anything else we can help with? Mm, well, things are settling down here, so it's okay for now. Why don't you two go outside and play? Don't wander too far, though. All right, let's go play. I heard recently about something washing ashore. Josh, why don't you go and check it out? Yes, let's go check it out. A little bit of dill instead of pepper sometimes tastes good on eggs. Oh, that's a good idea, I guess. I guess I'll have to try that. I don't usually, I don't, I, actually I don't eat eggs a lot. Okay, so let's go play outside. Let's go, let's go outside. Not on the egg, you cook the egg with butter in the pan. Oh, I see. <laughs> I see. Yeah, usually I cook them with oil. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, so she said something was washing ashore or something, so I'm not sure where she wants me. <laughs> I'm not sure where my sister wants me. Oh, maybe there? There's some stuff over there. Oh, maybe, maybe down there? Oh, yeah, I think so. Oh, maybe, yeah, maybe that's it. The music is pretty chill too, pretty relaxing, pretty pretty good music so far. I don't know if it's always the same theme though, or if it's gonna change with like... I don't think there's seasons in this game, but I, I don't know if the music is always the same. Extravagant meat dish recipe. Oh, so I got the recipe. Uh, fish preserve info. Uh, okay, so I can't do anything with that. So I think you can get some fish from here. So, okay, I'm, I'm, I think I'm probably not where she wanted me to go. Maybe I, oh, maybe I needed to talk with her, actually. I haven't played this game in almost a year, but I got so far just to stop. Yeah, well, I've waited three years to play this game, so... It's never too late to get back into it. Right? It reminds me of my time at Porsche. Mm, maybe a little bit. But I think the, in terms of gameplay, I think it's quite, quite different. Um, oh, so you can teleport to the cafe, actually. Uh, let me just see. Sorry. Take what you found back to the cafe. Oh. Oh, okay, so I just need to go back. Okay. Mom, we're home. Welcome home. Did you have fun? Yep, the weather is really nice. It's so refreshing. Good to hear. Mom, take a look at this. Just found this out on the shore. Do you know what it is? Hmm, well, it looks like there's something written on it. Ingredients, seasoning. It looks like a recipe of sort. What kind of recipe? I'm not sure, I think there's more to it. It could be a recipe for a dish that I've never made before. Does this game include a combat system too? Yes, yeah, so there is combat in this game. Um, I think it's actually the the dragon is gonna fight for you, so it's not like a huge amount of combat I don't think but th there is some action. I Love the art style and the characters themselves while the background is simple I wish I could make a character half as cute in some of the more detailed engines games have Yeah, it is definitely a really nice art style um, I think it's cute that they work with their mother not like so many other games where you move somewhere on your own, right? Thanks for the meal, it was delicious. Thank you so much, I hope you come back soon. Looks like we have another happy customer. Josh, could you go and clear the table for me? You can go ahead and put the plates right into the sink, of course. Examine plates left, okay. Let's just pick up the plates, put them in the sink. Clean up.
Oh, that's right. I have a favor to ask. Could you grab some onions for me? Sure. Um, what are those again? You can pick vegetables from certain shrubs around the island. Butterflies like to fly around them, so keep an eye out for those. I'm sure you'll be able to find some as soon as you go outside. Got it. I'll go look for some right now. Remember, after harvesting all the vegetables from a shrub, you'll have to wait a while to pick from it again. Don't forget to put the onions in the food storage once you get them, okay? I'm counting on you. Alright. Picking onions from a shrub, that's definitely interesting. You can't run while holding stuff, huh? Yeah, you can only run... Yeah, yeah, exactly. And I think later the cafe can get pretty busy. And I, I think you have like employees helping you as well. Different types of gather spots exist. Look for spots with butterflies flying nearby or spots with fruits on them. If I'm going to turn unavailable, they may be gathered again after a period of time. Ingredients are ranked and are considered better in the following order. Fresh, rare, and shiny. Alright, so that's... That's how you get food in this game. So these bushes with lots of vegetables on them. So I got one onion, two onions, three onions. Let's try to find more. I don't think there's going to be more for now, right? Oh, maybe this one. Sugar. Sugar. And sugar. And what about here? I oh, so it's going to be ready in a little while. So maybe you can... I don't know if you can choose what crops you plant here. I, it seems... It's, I think it's probably random. Alright, so we've got our onion. So let's make our onion soup. Actually, I'm not sure what we're supposed to make with that onion. But let's bring this onion to our mom. The ingredients were stuck in the food storage. Oh, okay. So where's the food storage, actually? Is it this one? Oh, yes. Click, clack, rice, generic, flour, zuki, bacon, white egg, sugar, onion, cabbage. Those are some fresh onions. Thank you so much. I know. Oops. Sorry. I think sardines will do just fine. Will you go and catch one for me? I know I keep saying this, but don't forget to put it in the food storage once you catch one. Alright, so let's go get some sardines. There's probably lots of fish swimming around the rocks by the shore. Okay, so we've been there earlier, right? Let's keep an eye out for places where fishes are coming up to the surface. Oh! Don't forget to pay close attention to the bobber after you cast it. Once you see it, start dipping below the surface, reel it in to catch the fish. Good luck. Thank you. This game looks so stinking cute. Yeah, it is <laughs> definitely cute. Even though there's lots of loading screen. Really, really cute game. Seems like Josh loves games with cooking system. Yes, well, I love farming games and things like that. So <laughs> most of the games I do play have some kind of cooking system in them. So let's go on the shore, get some sardines. And it's getting late, almost 6 p.m. Actually, I think, I think time doesn't, like, time is not, because it's the first day. So I think time is kind of... Depending on the, the events. Alright, so... Also, oh, it's not here. Oh, fishing. Fish by pressing A. Near an area where fishes can be seen. Oh, look for their shadow. A fish is on the line when the bobber sinks in the exclamation mark icon. is displayed above the player's head. Really then using A. Oh, okay. So here. Like this. So you just wait. And you just press A once, so you don't have like to press repeatedly or like quickly or anything like that. So maybe we can try to get, get a few fish. I love this game. It's a nice, casual, relaxing game. The only thing that sucks is time passes by so quickly. Oh, does it? But at least there's no like... I don't think there's any time limit or anything, right? So there's no... There's no rush to do things, right? 
this game makes me think of Harvest Moon. Yeah, so actually this game was the, the was produced by Yasuhiro Wada, who was the producer of the the first Harvest Moon games. So that's part of the reason why I wanted to play it. Because it takes inspiration, like it has some similarities. It's not really like a farming game, because you can't really like farm. But it has some some similarities. Alright, let's cook something. Great work, you two. Thank you for helping me out here. No problem at all. Mm, Mom, are you okay? You look a little pale. Oh, don't worry, I'm fine. I think I'm just a bit tired. Hey, what would you do like for breakfast tomorrow? Meat, fish, maybe some vegetables? Um, I wanna eat veg uh, fish. Fish it is! I'm going to pour my heart into this one. So I hope the two of you enjoy it. Yum, thanks mom. Mm, why don't you get some rest, mom? Oh, I'll be fine. There's still more to do too. I have some prep work I need to do for tomorrow. Mom, please take care. Of course. Thanks for worrying about me. You two should get some rest now. Sure. Mom, please take it easy, okay? I will, I will. Thank you, sweet dreams, you too. I sure hope it's worth it in 2022 because I just finally got the game. Oh, nice! Along with Jurassic World Evolution and Stranded Sales Explorers. You know what? I got Stranded Sales a few days ago as well. A few weeks ago, I got Stranded Sales. And I have not played it yet. I want to play it for a video or something. I'm looking forward to trying it. Some people said it was really good. Oh, 120 people. Thank you so much, guys, for joining me today. Such a cute game. I was really looking forward to playing it on the Switch, but it ran horribly. Oh, no. I think it's not too bad. Well, so far, it doesn't seem to be running too bad. My father did tell me about it since I was little. The blood flowing in me is... I guess... I guess my time has come. Uh-oh. Stranded Sales was a quick play, but fun in my opinion. Oh, really? Is it short? Save the game by sleeping in the bed. You will wake up in the morning, revisit previous scenes using the album. Oh, that's interesting. So you can see some cutscenes again and again. Ah, oh, yeah, you can see all the cutscenes here. So that's nice. I love when games do that. That's so cute. All right, let's sleep. <laughs> Put fish in the refrigerator. I think they, they go in the storage automatically, so you don't have to put them. Morning, the weather outside looks perfect. We should go gather some ingredients after breakfast. Yes. Oh, where's mom? Morning, mom. Uh oh. Oh no. Where's mom? This is weird. I wonder if she overslept. I'm so hungry. Who's gonna make fish for us? Why don't we go and check her room? Oh, this is so sad. M mom doesn't usually oversleep. What's going on? Hey, mom! Rise and shine! Mom? What's going on? Why isn't she waking up? Josh, what's wrong with mom? Mom, wake up! Mom! She's still breathing, at least. Oh. What's that? Oh! What? Hiya! Hiya! Phew, I'm glad I made it in time. Oh, wait, I guess I didn't. Huh? Who are you? 
I am a wizard. Um, no, I am but a lowly old man. But enough about me. It looks like your mother hasn't woken up yet. Yep. What's going on? Well, your mother is part human and part dragon. You do know that, right? She's what? Oh, so you didn't know. See, her human and dragon blood aren't sinking, so obviously she isn't doing well. Sinking? Yeah, uh, indeed. In other words, oh, how can I put this? Her blood types aren't matching together well. I don't know if I understand. In any case, it seems I was a little too late. So, mom's in critical condition? What can we do to make her better? Hmm, it won't be easy. But there is a way to bring harmony between her blood types. Here we go. Now, this isn't some ordinary egg, kids. It's a very special dragon's egg. If you raise it properly, I'm sure it will give you the help you need. Yay! So, what you're saying is we can save mom if we raise a dragon? Yes, but you have to do more than watch it grow. You must raise a fine dragon by feeding it delicious food. Delicious food? But mom won't be able to help us with that. Why the long faces, you two? Have a little confidence. I only said delicious as an example. I honestly don't know how to raise it, but I'm sure it will grow nice and strong if you give it lots of love. Don't you dare think about eating the egg. <laughs> it's a giant delicious egg. Mmm. So, you two aren't very confident in your cooking skills, huh? Nope, oh, he's hungry. Are you hungry? Nope. <laughs> um, it looks like I'm not the only one. Come now, it's time to eat. You two have to save your mother. Make sure you eat well so you have lots of energy for the road ahead. Mom. Old man. Come now, call me Pappy. <laughs> okay, Pappy. So, mom, mom's going to be okay, right? Well, first you're going to need to raise the dragon. Trust me, it will come all together in due time. Uh, Pappy? How do you even know, mom? We've never seen you before. Who are you? I just came here to help. Come now, do I look suspicious to you? Kind of. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't answer that. But you did come to help, right? If so, I'll trust you, Pappy. They're so cute. <laughs> now, let's have some breakfast. All this egg talk made me want to eat eggs myself. We can make a sunny side up for you if you'd like. Oh, that would be splendid. I'll take one of those. Come, set that precious egg aside for now and let's get started. Alright, let's make some sunny side egg for Pappy. Alright, like this. I wonder if every recipe has a different song or if it's always the same. Oh, it's a bit longer than the first one. Oh no, it's the same. Oh, I think I made it a little bit better than the first time, right? Hi Josh, happy I finally can watch your live stream. Kinda of hard since almost 12 hours different. Hi Freya, well I'm glad you're able to catch this one. I did start this stream a little bit of a different time than usual, so so more people, different people can catch it. So yeah, I'm glad you're able to make it. Yeah, I did it. Oh my patience has finally been met with such a delicious prospect. Now let's see how it tastes. I believe it changes depending on the dish type and if you add the secret ingredient. Oh, I see. That's good to know. Let's dig in. That looks like a delicious egg. You two have an incredible talent. It tasted truly wonderful. It's been many years since I've had a meal. I should eat like this more often. Oh, 
our egg is hatching already. The egg! And we've got a beautiful blue dragon. Oh, he's so cute! <laughs> it hatched so early, my goodness, I'm glad I didn't hatch. I'm glad it didn't hatch while I was traveling here. What? It's so small and adorable, I love it already. Oh, are we gonna have to give it a name? Oh yeah, let's name the dragon. Draco. Mm, that's kind of basic, right? How should we name the dragon? You guys should help me pick some name. For a cute little blue dragon, we can have 12 characters. Yeah. Mm. I don't know if you can change that later. Probably not, right? So, not something good. Mochi, Nero, Azul, Sky, Ryu, Sparky, Azur. Azur? Azur is cute. Cobalt. Sapphire. Oh, Sapphire! Sapphira. Sapphira, that's cute. It is fun to play new characters, come to start new quests. It gets difficult as the game advances to get enough needed ingredients. You need to change your menus often based on what you have on hand. Yeah, I've heard some people tell me it was a difficult game, actually. That was surprising. I didn't expect that. Haru King 64? <laughs> Azura. Azura is cute. Um How about Norbert like Hagrid's dragon in Harry Potter? Mmm. Lapis. Oh Lapis is cute. You can change the dragon's color, so maybe don't name it a color. Oh that's oh that's good to know actually. Okay, let's not pick a color based name. Um Hi Josh, hi chat, hi M, hope you're doing good. My gosh, 140 people. I, di I didn't think there would be that many people watching a live stream of a game that's <laughs> almost four years old. So I just want to say thank you so much everybody for joining me today. And... Uh, yeah, I'm trying to find a name for the dragon right now. We've got lots of good suggestions, but I feel like there's nothing... Nothing yet that I really, really like. I named mine Azul and then it ended up red. Oh, see? Yeah. Ah, how should we name him? Or her, maybe it's... Mm. Talon? I don't know what's Talon. In French that means like heal, so that's kind of a weird <laughs> name. BB Spyro. Spyro is kind of cute, but I want something original. Dr. Aegon. Nope. <laughs> this game is four years old. I've never heard of it before. This Yeah, it came out in 2018. Well, it's probably more like t three years old than something. Um, why is it so hard to find a dragon's name? Talon like claw might be s oh claw oh. J tofu <laughs> cinder oh my gosh I can't decide I can't pick okay I can't spend too many I can't spend too much time just thinking about the name uh. um. Okay, I can't spend too much time on this. Okay, how should we name? I wish there was a random, random, like, randomizer. Tofu is kind of cute. Yeah, maybe we could find, like, a food base. Since we, since we run a cafe, I think we should find some food-based name. Like... Like something you would eat at a cafe. I just it is fun to play buy it from eBay or Amazon overpriced at Nintendo Online. Yeah, I bought it from Amazon. It was 50% off. Muffin, marshmallows. Asiano is Spanish for cornflower, bluish flower. Macaron. Oh, macaron is cute, actually. Mochi. Mochi is cute as well. Ah, uh, donut, mocha. 
I love mocha. Mmm. Pork chop. <laughs> Omelet. Omelet is kind of you know what? That's kind of tacky, but. I think it would be cute. Espresso. Oh, that's cute. Egg tart. Oh, egg tart is cute. Oh, sorbet. Oh, sorbet is nice. A lot of people are saying mochi. Um. Oh my gosh. Penny, thank you so much for the super sticker. What color is the dragon? So it's blue, but the color can change later, so... Thank you so much for the super sticker. Um, Creme brulee. <laughs> My dog's name is Star Tough. He's really cute. Toasty. Ah, Toasty makes sense, right? Since it's kind of like it's a dragon. Mochi. I think Mochi is cute. Toughy. Toughy is cute too. Um, okay, I can't spend too much time on this. Macaron sounds cute. Milk, uh, maybe macaron? What about macaroni? No, maybe just macaron. Should we go for macaron? I think I'm gonna go for macaron. Yeah, okay, let's do that. Okay, all right, let's go for Macaron. All right, Macaron, that's such a good name. It's hungry. It was just born and it already wants to chow down. Typically coming from a dragon. Typical coming from a dragon. Oh, we still have one more serving of that sunny side up. I was planning on eating that, <laughs> but I guess you can give it to our little dragon friend here. Oh my gosh, you can make like so many, so many eggs with just one egg. Say, Josh, let's feed the dragon that's sunny side up. Yes. Macaron reminds me of the little pink thing from... Oh, from Kitara Fables, right? In Kitara Fables, there's a little pink character. It's called Macaron. Cooked dishes must be fed to the dragon. Choose a dish from the menu to feed the dragon. The select give to dragon. The dragon's stamina will recover greatly. So as you can see in the bottom left, there's the dragon's stamina. Food given to the dragon will affect its color. Dishes contain dragon dye. And by giving the same dye up to a certain amount, the dragon's color changes. Alright. Let's feed Macaron a sunny side up. Alright, so how do I do that? How do I feed him, actually? Uh, maybe I need to cook it again? Wait. Did I miss something really obvious? Uh, this... Oh, give to dragon. I'm probably going to buy this game now, sorry, bank account. <laughs> it just looks so cute, like living in a storybook world. Yeah, it's really, really cute. And it's on sale right now on Amazon. At least last week it was on like 50% off. What a gourmand. We'll have to keep making delicious meals to raise this little one. What a peculiar cry. It is a very special dragon after all. Okay, it's time for me to explain the next step. You two will cook for this little one, raising it to become a fine dragon. Then mom will get better? Let's do it, Josh. Yeah, the cafe is really empty, right? Think about what your mother would want for this place. You must also continue running the cafe. What? On our own? That's impossible. Impossible, eh? I see. Well, that's rather unfortunate. Your poor mother, with such unreliable children, <laughs> I'm not sure she'll ever wake up again. We can do... Let's do this for mom. Oh, sorry. We can do it. Let's do this for mom. The cafe, the dragon, we can handle it all, right, Josh? Good, good. While you're at it, you can keep cooking for me. Oh, and I'll need a room to stay in. What? You're staying here, papi? Oh, the dragon's so cute. And that's how the two siblings began their quest to raise the dragon and protect their dear mother's cafe. Up until now, the twins have never had to do anything on their own. What lies before them on the journey ahead? Oh, the excitement. 
I've heard mixed things about this game, but it seems interesting. Yeah, I've heard really mixed things as well, which is why I waited so long to play this game and I got it on sale. I will like the stream. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, guys, please feel free to like the stream. That really helps. Press the Y button to pet the dragon. Petting the dragon will slightly raise its health. You can also call the dragon over when it's far away by pressing Y. All right. You need more menu items to run the cafe. To get things started here, you should search for recipe fragments in the cafe. Collect bar fragments to restore them to a recipe. So are, are the fragments in the cafe? Is that what they said? So they said four recipe fragments in the cafe, right? So let's explore inside the cafe. Is it a marvelous game? Yes, I believe. Um. No, actually, it's not published by Marvelous. Um, it's made by Toy Box Inc. And however, the CEO of Toy Box Inc. is Yasuhiro Wada, who produced the first Harvest Moon games. So it has a lot of similarities to like games from Marvelous, but it's not from Marvelous. The Switch version, at least, was pretty buggy. Yeah, I'm playing the Switch version right now. Um, I wasn't sure if I should get it on Steam. At first, I was like, should I get it on Steam? Oops, no, I didn't want to do this. I was thinking of getting it on Steam, but it was not on sale. Oops, sorry. Uh, it was not on sale on Steam, and also, uh, like, the box art, like, the cover art is just so cute. So I really wanted the physical version, so I bought it on the Switch, even though I know, like... Apparently, it's a little bit more buggy. It feels like a drag late game when perfecting recipes for selling and playing the rhythm games over and over again. Yeah, that's what I've heard as well. Because you have to do like always the same recipes. Like if you want to cook 10, 10 meals, you have to do the little mini game 10 times, right? You have a blue dragon. I'm 100% sure mine was in blue. Yeah, so I think the color you get is random at first, but then depending on the food that you give your dragon, um, it's gonna change color. She really looks like Felicity, right? She really does. She really does look like Felicity from A New Beginning. Harvest Moon A New Beginning. Wait, let me just check something. Search the cafe and find the recipe fragments and get some sleep. So the recipe fragments are inside the cafe, right? Unless it's like just a translation error. I'll make sure to keep an eye out on things while you're gone. I don't know if it's like a translation error. And maybe they're like the fragments are actually outside the cafe. I'm just like pressing A. Pressing A everywhere trying to find like some recipe fragments, but I don't think. Okay, yeah, let's go outside. This game can play on Nintendo Swift. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it does play on the Nintendo Switch, yes. Maybe the first color was chosen when just chose fish for breakfast. Oh, maybe that's why. Maybe that's how you... Ah, maybe if you pick meat, it's gonna be red. If you pick fish, it's gonna be blue. And if you pick like vegetables, it's gonna be red or uh, green. Maybe something like that. That, that would make sense, right? Oh, yeah, so there were, I think that was maybe like a... Uh, a translation error or something Because yeah, it does look like the recipes are outside increasing the cafe's reputation or raising the customer satisfaction level might prompt LDC staff or Other customers to share recipe. Okay It's what you choose for breakfast changes colors. I see during the dragon's early stage, stand near the hole and press the A button while search is displayed to make the dragon crawl. The hole may have ingredients. Oh, nice. Macaron. Come here. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, he was looking at me. This is so cute. Oh, he got some meat. Zuki. I don't know what's, zu what's Zuki. I don't know if he can get more than one. Oh, yeah. Alright, I think that's it for this. So let's check. There's another. There's more stuff over there. And we've got some little egg. Mm. 
Let's see if this game's good or not. Put this debate to rest. I've been tempted to get it a few times here and there, but the mixed reviews always put me off. Yeah, it was the same for me, which is why I waited so long, just because the reviews are so mixed. So many people love this game, and so many people don't like it, so... I want to try it and, like, figure this out by myself. It seems too expensive. Yeah, well, you should check out on... I know it was on sale on Amazon. It was 50% off when I got it, so you should... But, yeah, otherwise the regular price is, like, quite expensive. Oh, I still can't go there. Okay, so have I got... So I got one fragment. Uh, let's go... Is that... That's not ready quite yet, right? These are gonna be tomatoes, I think. Alright, let's go in. Is it on sale right now? Yeah, on Amazon it's 50 per At least on Amazon.ca. I think on Amazon.com as well. Uh, no, I need more, right? Search the cafe and find the recipe fragments. And get some sleep. Should I go get some sleeps right away? Um... Let's see what we can... Sorry, progress. Status. Recipe. Oh, so you can see the fragments like hearty made dish. I got two out of four. Oh, I see. And there's a lot. Wow. A huge ton of recipes. So I'm not too sure what the fragments... Maybe I should go to sleep. Maybe I'm gonna go to sleep. I'd say it's worth it if it's on sale, but with it being buggy, it's not worth full price. Yeah. Well, I haven't encountered many bugs. Oh. <laughs> I haven't encountered, like, many bugs so far. But I mean, I just started playing, right? On Amazon US, it's on sale 45% off. That's good. That's a good deal. There are only four copies left. Yeah, I feel like on Amazon that happens a lot. Like, they always say, like, one copy left, but... You shouldn't let that, like, get to you too much. I'm sure I'm sure they're gonna have it for a little while. But... Yeah, if it's on sale, I don't know if it goes on sale very often. So if you're tempted, maybe you should get it if it's on sale. Alright, let's see if there's anything new today. Maybe I can... Oh, yeah, there's something else here. Some more sugar, which I'm sure it's gonna be quite useful. And we can probably check this one. Oh, no, so you can't get this one every day. So maybe let's go on the shore. Oh, there's something on the... There's a little cave on the shore as well. Just pick up some eggs. Oh, I forgot to pet Macaron. Okay, let me pet him. Ah, oh, that's so cute. I already spent my moolah on RCS and I gotta save more for Rune Factory 5. Hoping I can afford it when it comes out. Yeah, I hope so. Well, you still have two months for Rune Factory 5, so hopefully... Hopefully you can get the money by then. Yeah, are you guys excited for RCS? So it's coming out to, in two days, right? Or tomorrow? I'm not I'm not that into Pokemon, so I don't mind too much. But I know a lot of people are really excited for that game. So I hope... I've watched a few reviews. Because the reviews started coming out today. Where is my camera? Oh. Uh, and I think the reviews are pretty good in general, right? So I hope you guys will enjoy it. These birds look like cats. Like, they look like cats like this, but when they start flying, they look like birds. Shiny Zuki bacon. Oh. Shiny bacon. Ah, this game is making me hungry. Hearty meat dish too. Oh, so I'm just missing one piece for the hearty meat dish, right? Grilled dory skewers. Okay, let's fish. Look at the tiny legs on that dragon. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he's so adorable. Well, he's gonna grow. He's not always gonna be that small and cute. This game looks so cute and adorable. I got it on Steam and it was on sale during the winter sale. Nice. I hope you're enjoying it so far. Should be a Steam Lunar sale soon, I think, right? Oh, do they do... 
Yeah, it's gonna be the Chinese New Year, right? Soon? Do they do usually like pretty big sales? Hopefully you should have the money when it comes out, but I gotta pay for some expensive stuff that I don't want to pay for too, so I don't know. Oh, that's too bad. Yeah, that's that's life, right? You gotta pay for... Gotta pay for stuff you don't want to pay for. First of February, my birthday and Chinese New Year. Let's go. Oh, nice. I hope you're gonna get something nice for your birthday or like... Uh, do something fun or like something special. Uh, I think tomorrow's we tomorrow we should have some tomatoes. Yeah, so the area the oh we can shake trees. Ah, uh, the ones with the butterflies, right? They look like Easter Easter eggs. What's that? Persimmon. Oh. Do we have more fruit trees right now? Mm, no, that's the only one, I think. Oh, something here. Maybe some recipe. Hearty meat dish. Oh, yes. So I can go cook that. Probably with my bacon. I'm going to be 21, so I probably won't get anything. I stopped getting presents when I turned 18, but I'm going to buy myself dinner. Yeah, if you don't get presents, you definitely should get, get something for yourself. Usually that's that's what I do. I always treat myself because you can't you can't rely on other people to treat yourself, right? So please have fun and have a nice dinner. And my kid keeps asking me for expensive stuff. Oh, I see. Yeah. Well, you can just say no, right? That's <laughs> that's what my parents did. But yeah, that's tough. Looks like you've gathered the recipe fragments you need. About that, we can't tell what this this recipe is for with just with this. Uh, if only we could restore the recipe from the recipe fragments that we collected. Mm, come see me later with the recipe fragments you've got. I'll be waiting on the second floor. All right, let's go see Pappy. Collect four recipe fragments and see Pappy on the second floor so he can restore the recipe for you. If a recipe can be restored, okay, all right. Uh, I think he's in... Oh, there he is. Ta-da! Steak bowl! Oh, so that's the hearty meat dish. Collect four recipe fragments and bring them to me. I'll add it to the menu. Get cooking. All right, let's go make some steak. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do steak with my bacon. Maybe, maybe not. Um, Let's see. Steak bowl, a robust dish with a whole steak on rice, perfect for the hungry. Oh yeah, so you can use <laughs> you can use the bacon to make a whole steak. So with some click clack rice and zuki bacon. Yay! Rich, slightly salty steak bowl. Dishes already made can be added to the cafe menu. Customers will be able to place order for these dishes. If a new dish is made, try adding it by selecting Update Cafe Menu. And when using the same recipe, the dish rank number of star can change depending on ingredients and execution. Enter highly ranked dishes with as many stars as possible into the cafe menu and raise the cafe's reputation. Thank you very much. Update cafe menu. So I'm gonna add, um, so menu item. So I'm running out. So I don't know if I have to prepare like a lot of like dishes in advance. So I have five dishes. Because it says running out, so I don't know if I should like prepare some in advance or if you just prepare them when the customers ask for them. I'm not too sure. Um, okay, let's see what we should do next. Um, search the cafe and find the recipe fragments. Oh, okay, same. All right, let's speak with our sis. Josh, after you're tired from gathering ingredients, you should get some rest on the bed. Yeah, well, it's just 2 p.m., so let's go outside. Let's see if there's anything else we can get. 
I will, I'm gonna go out and buy it for me and my mom. It does feel funny that I'm buying for us both even though it's my birthday though. Yeah, right? The bacon is becoming beef. Yeah, well, I guess you can have a pork steak, right? But, I don't know. Um... So, can I... Yeah, I still can't go there, so I think I might have to go to sleep. There's probably not much... Probably not much I can do. Actually, I'm gonna make some food for my... Oh, that's adorable. Okay, I'm gonna give him some food, actually. So, dragon colors, you can see, so that's red. And his health is gonna go back up. Yeah. Or is that his stamina or his health? Oh, he's so happy. Okay, I, I, I think I'm gonna go to sleep. I think there's, like, nothing else I can do <laughs> right now. So, yeah, that's pretty limited for the first area. So, let's go to sleep. This game looks pretty cute. I've had it on my wishlist for a long time, but I always ended up not buying it because I have so many other games to play. Yeah, I have so many games to play as well, and... But, yeah, I, I just couldn't resist anymore. Can you cross the bridge? Yeah, you can't cross the bridge for now. So, the more progress you make in the game, the more areas you'll unlock. Oh, oh, who are these? Welcome! What? Where's your mother? Oh, mom isn't feeling well. The two of us are going to be managing the cafe for a while. Oh dear, that's troubling. Could these two even handle it? You know youngsters these days, they don't really have the juice. Now, now, quit scaring the kids, we'll just have to help them get up to speed. Yes, that's exactly right. I appreciate that, thank you. Who let all the old guys in? <laughs> well, I'm beat for today, so I'll head back to my room to rest. Good luck! Thank you, Pappy. Uh oh. Welcome! Oh, where are the three other guys from before? Need food, going to die of hunger. Josh, what should we serve him? Let's make some steak for him. I think I'm gonna faint. Oh no. What? Hang in there, Josh, let's hurry. Yes, I'm gonna make some steak for you. He looks famous, maybe we should serve him something really hearty. Mmm, hearty. I know, how about the steak bowl? Of course. He looks like Clink. He, do he does look like Clink a little bit, right? How's the gameplay so far? It's still early, but I'm enjoying it so far. There are situations in which certain dishes will be needed to progress. Gather recipes and ingredients to make the specified dish. All right. So let's make the steak bowl. That looks so delicious. Like this. Click, clack, rice. Ooh, I think that's gonna be five. I think that's gonna be perfect, right? Yes, supreme, slightly salty steak bowl. All right, there you are. Here's your steak bowl. Oh man, this it smells so good. I'm digging in. <laughs> Wow, that was incredible! Nothing I've eaten in my village have ever come close. You know, I left that place so I could try and make it as a musician. I just had to leave and take it on the world. Take on the world. Oh my! Spoken like a true youngster. That's the problem with kids these days. They got no grit. Always trying to leave home. Back in my day. Yeah, let him have it. Now, now, there's a time and place for everything. This young man is just finding his place in the world. Yeah, I got that right. Oh, 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 what, what's happening? 
That hooligan, he's trying to make a break for it without paying. Oh no. Now, now, this young man is just trying to leave his mark on the world. Let's just see what happens. Josh, we have to go after him. Oh no. <laughs> the other guy was just sleeping. How do you like the cooking minigame? It is pretty cute, it is pretty fun. I don't apparently it gets very repetitive, like after you when you have to cook a lot. But so far, so good. What the heck is this thing doing? <laughs> wow! Hey! Cut it out! Macaron looks happy, I think it likes him. Come on, just go away. Oh man. Great work, Macaron. You got him red-handed. <laughs> That is so cute. I'm really sorry, this won't ever happen again. Youngsters these days. Yeah, let him have it. Now, now, that was still some fine running. What did we give to run so nimbly? Ah, the youth. Yeah, got that right. <laughs> that guy's always saying the same two phrases. It's just, I don't have any money. Even though I couldn't pay, I didn't want to die of starvation, you know? Oh. Mm. If you don't have the cash, you should work off your debt. They serve you in kindness, you owe them your life. Now, now. Hey, wait, that's actually a good idea. Yeah, that's exactly what you should do. <laughs> what? You want me to work here? Oh, yay! Having another person on staff could would help us out a ton. Yes. I just been playing along. Hi, Blue Dart. Been playing for an hour, seven minutes now. So we're still in the pretty, pretty early beginning. I left my village so I didn't have to work for my old man anymore. A skinny, no good, lily livered punk like yourself could use a little more work in his life. All right, all right, fine. Okay, I'll do it. Hooray! The name is Billy. Nice to meet ya. <laughs> Macaron did some fine work today, but this youngster does seem rather unreliable. But no matter who it is, it's reassuring that the cafe will have more staff on hand. This is getting quite interesting. Alright, so now... I think uh, let's go get some let's make some food for our dragon actually maybe yeah let's make a little steak for macaron I wouldn't trust him he's just gonna steal ingredients yeah I don't know if we can trust him but that's Better than no one, right? I guess. But apparently your employees, from what I've seen from some reviews, so you're, you have employees working for you and helping with the cafe, but apparently a lot of them are slacking off and you have to keep like telling them to work. So I don't know how he's, I feel like he's gonna be more of an nuisance, more like an annoyance than anything else, but I guess we'll see. I remember having to yell at him often to get back to work because he will stop midship and just play guitar. Oh no. Can I speak with him? I know it was a bad I know it was bad to try to dine and dash, but if I didn't know they were gonna put me to work. Yeah. Well oh well. Okay, let's go out. Let's go see how our sister is doing. There aren't many dishes I can make. I have to gather a lot more different types of recipes. Alright, let's go out, see if there's anything interesting today. Here's hoping this game crashes less for you than it did for me. Yeah, so far, the first hour, I didn't encounter any bugs or anything like that, so it's been running pretty smoothly. But, yeah, a lot of people are having issues with this issues with this game, so... Vegetables, fruit, spices, or meat that were obtained once before can be harvested from the garden. Oh, you can harvest meat from a garden? They're <laughs> very engaged in crop info. Okay. Fish already cut can also be obtained from the fish preserve. So that's interesting. So you don't have to always like go out of your way to get specific ingredients. Garden fish preserve and dragon manure. You can use manure at the garden fish preserve. If you have dragon manure, use dragon manure. Okay. 
Oh, and now I can explore a bit more. So that's good. Oh, so we've got lots of stuff here. So examine, harvest. Oh, so yeah, you get bacon, onion, carrot. So it's kind of like random. You get like a lot of stuff. All right, so that's pretty convenient. So let's go see the fish preserve and get some fish. I experienced so much lag in this game. I wanted to love it, but I couldn't. Oh, no. I think it's not too bad, right? I think. there's. It's kind of stuttering a little bit, but as I said earlier, I think it's more like a stylistic choice than like a frame rate. I think it's just like how the animation is rather than an actual like frame rate drop. All right, thank you very much. And let's check our little fish. I don't know if it's gonna be ready or not. Ah, not yet. Maybe tomorrow. I still have 72 games on my wish list I want to get. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. <laughs> but I only got $5 left. Need to get more money for my Steam wallet. Oh no. Yeah. Same for me. There are so many games I want to buy, but at the same time, I have so many games I... So many games I bought, I have not played yet. I imagine your switch stuttering when you're trying to perfect the rhythm game. So I have not s encountered any like stutters in the rhythm game. So I think that that was pretty good. Are you playing on switch? Yeah, so I'm playing on the switch right now. So if you want to see the performance, that's how that's how it runs on the switch. So I think it runs well. All right, so we got that, and now let's check over. Okay, let me let me just get everything here actually, and then we're gonna go over the bridge and explore the new area. So today is a carrot day for the bush, and here persimmon. Okay, so that's the same fruit as before. Orange and orange. Uh, oh, yeah, already. Yeah, time goes by pretty fast, actually, right? I played back at original release. Hopefully, they patched a bit. Yeah, so I'm on version 1.03, 1 so I think they updated the game, like, three times. Um, I think it was all, like, shortly after the release. But, yeah, there has been a few little updates, so I think if you might want to give it another try, and it's maybe better than how it was. Alright, let's talk to that guy. I was cleaning this just now. It's gonna take a little longer. Sorry, but come back at another time. So, I think I might have... Oh, no. I need one more. One more part for that. Skewers recipe. Oh, I can probably get some eggs here. Wild egg bird. If you catch a wild egg bird, you can raise it next to the cafe where it will lay an egg every morning. Be careful as the egg birds will return to where they came from after a few days. Oh, I see. So you can, ah, uh, you can put them near your farm, but they're kind of temporary. This is making me want to get back into this. It's been so long since I played, and yours is running much smoother than mine did. So I've got hope. Yeah. Well, if you're also I'm playing on docked mode, so I don't know if you are playing in the handheld or docked. So maybe that makes a difference as well. Field general controls, return to the cafe. Yeah, that's nice. You can return to the cafe instantly. Uh, I don't know if you uh, if you pass out at a certain time or anything like that. But I'm going to try to collect everything I can collect. Some nice spinach, radish, spinach, radish, shiitake. And... Yeah, we still have more to ex Oh, I shouldn't wander too far. All right, so that's pretty much it. So let's... Is there anything else? Yeah, I think that's all. Let's go back to the cafe.
All right. Oh, did I pet my dragon today? I don't know what happens if you let, uh, if you let your, if you don't feed your dragon, what happens? Or like if the stamina of your dragon goes down, like what happens? I don't know. Oh, dragon manure. This is made with high ranked ingredients. Use. Wait, this is made with high ranked ingredients. Use lower rank ingredients if you like high ranked ones. This lowers the satisfaction rate of the dish you use. Dragon manure to get high ranked ingredients. Okay, I see. That's a lot of manure in his <laughs> little bed. Okay, all right, let's go to sleep. And tomorrow I'm gonna put. Well, maybe I could put the manure right now, actually. So, yeah. Hey, hey, I changed my name from Red Rose Mandy. Hi, Princess Danda. Hope you're doing good. Is this on Steam too? I almost want to try it again if it is. Yes, it is on Steam. So it's on PS4, Steam, and Switch. I got the Switch version just because the box is like really cute. Um. But it, it does run pretty well. I was scared it was not going to run well on the Switch, but actually, I, uh, for me, I know some people are more picky, but for me, it runs well enough, I think. Oh, so that's really like instant, right? Maybe if you forget to feed your dragon, he eats one of the customers. <laughs> it could be cool. Yeah, I'm not sure. Maybe he grows up fat. I think. The rate at which a dragon grows, I think, just depends on, like, your progress in the story. So, I'm not too sure what... Well, besides just changing the color, I'm not too sure what the food is for. We're gonna feed manure to people. No, you don't use the manure to feed people. It's just to... Just to use as fertilizer to make your ingredients better. I thought you might have got it on sale a few weeks ago. It was like 15 bucks or something on the eShop. So I got it on sale on Amazon. It was 50% off. So it was like uh, 40 Canadian dollars, like 39.99. So I got it on sale, but yeah, I didn't get it on the eShop. Mm, okay, so let's cook something for our dragon, even though I don't know what's the point of it. Uh, I guess it's gonna... I guess I'll figure it out by playing a little bit more. Maybe... Let's make a sunny side up. I haven't made a sunny side up in a little while, so let's do that. Oops. Also, I don't know if the food spoils. I think I can probably make, like, continue cooking. I can probably make a few. I subscribe. Oh, thank you so much for subscriber sub subscribing, Jeremiah. Hope you're doing well and I hope you're enjoying the stream so far. This is a really cute game, but I kind of wish it were a visual novel with a cooking system as gameplay and didn't have the exploration aspects because the map is hard for me to explore. I see. Yeah, a lot of people, that's one thing. Like this game is so, seems so divisive. Like some people say the exploration is a lot of fun. And some people say they don't like it. Some people say the game runs smoothly. Some people say it runs badly. So everybody has such a different opinion on this game. But uh, so far, so far for me, so far so good. It's still very early, but I'm really enjoying it so far. Okay, all right. So let's give a little egg to our dragon. I don't know if the quality also makes a difference for the dragon. Awesome, 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 awesome. Okay, so next, let's go out. It's got good points and looks very cute, but yeah, there are issues. Yeah, but 
so far so good for me. Alright, let's pick up everything. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in this bush today. Alright, so let's go over there. Let's see if... Oh, I think the wild birds... Oh, yeah, so they teleport here automatically, right? When you pick them up. So I've got lots of eggs today. I'm pretty sure this is kind of like... It's probably quite hard to run out of eggs. So let's see if the path is cleared here. No, still not. Nope. I still can't come here. So I'm not too sure. Oh, there's maybe some fishing. Maybe I can get some new type of fish there. I was super hyped for this while I was waiting for it. The aesthetic art style is great, but it's so technically underwhelming that I couldn't get to the good part. I see. Oh, I think. Yes, you've collected four recipe fragments. I'm gonna go back. To Pappy. That's probably gonna trigger the next part of the story. You have to go to recapture the chickens every few days and it's annoying. Yeah, I've seen that. Um, yeah, running, running out to get the better chickens later. I see. Pancake! Oh nice! Collect four... Oh, I wanna eat pancakes now. Collect four recipe fragments and bring them to me. Yeah, okay. Alright, so let's make some pancakes. Oh! Are we getting another visitor? Oh, it looks like we're getting busy. Except him. <laughs> He's not doing anything. Excuse me, I'm ready to order now. Dude, what are you doing? Billy, can you get the order? No can do, it's break time. You're always taking a break. Oh, um, Billy, can you help me move this? Mm, I'm a little busy. What? What are you doing? You don't look busy to me. I don't expect you to understand what machina 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 machinations, machinations lie behind these eyes. I'm busy thinking about life. Like, what do we really need, you know? 10 hours of sleep a day, sweet tunes, oh, and breaks. That's the trinity of life. Welcome! Wow, what a lovely cafe. I didn't expect to find such a cute place all the way out here. Feel free to sit anywhere you like. Oh, oh welcome, welcome. I guess I'm having pancakes for dinner. Oh nice, I hope you enjoy them. You know what, maybe I should do that. At the well, I don't have milk and I need to go buy milk, but I could make pancakes. I love cafes. I'd like to eat a classic cafe dish. Can you recommend me something? Sure, a classic cafe dish. Pancakes. Billy, do any dishes come to mind? Pancakes. Josh, it looks like we'll have to think of one of our own. Pancakes. Is she a bum too? At least she's cute. Yeah, I think she's gonna be another one of our employees. I think she might be a bit better than Billy. What would make a good classic cafe dish? Mmm, a classic cafe dish. Pancakes. How about pancakes? Alright, so let's make those pancakes. So, sugar and flour.
Separating slightly sweet pancake. I'm right. I have this game played it halfway. Well, I hope you enjoyed the half. There's also lots of games I never finished, but I hope you enjoyed the half of the half of it that you played. Wow, this is exactly what I wanted. How can you come into a cafe and not order yourself pancakes, right? And the drawing, the illustrations of the food look so good. So delicious, the perfect pancake. Thank you very much for the meal. You're welcome. Oh. Mm, this is such a cute cafe, but I think you all could speed up the wait time for the food a bit more. Are you short on staff? Big money, big money, jackpot. So, who's that guy over there? <laughs> he doesn't work here, does he? Actually, he does. Mm, well, he does. Oh. That stupid oaf works here. This is completely unforgivable. Hey, loser, wake up! How can you sleep while these two work their tails off? Such a nice cafe doesn't deserve a bum like you. Unforgivable. Oops. <laughs> uh, so, who are you? Who am I? Don't you remember the faces of your customers? Oh, uh, sorry? Don't you know anything about working in the service industry? Like you're supposed to? Hey, are you even listening to me? The nerve of this idiot. What was that? So angry. I'm just... I'm gonna... Let's just all relax. Oh. <laughs> such a nice cafe. It's such a cute little cafe. It's so cute and yet... Ah. What? <laughs> what? What is she doing? What's happening? I did enjoy it and I will finish it after I play Legion's RCS. Nice. This was made by the Story of Seasons developers, right? Well, this was made... This was produced by Yasuhiro Wada, who used to work on Harvest Moon. And now he started his own company called uh, Toy Box Inc. So, it's a lot of the same people, but it, it is a different company. I am, I'm really sorry. <laughs> I lost myself for a minute there. I'll clean up, don't worry. Yeah, she, she went Super Saiyan, right? Look, I'm sorry for everything and this may not be the right time to ask, but I want to work here too. <laughs> I'll work really hard, I promise. I won't slack off at all. I want you to let me help. Well, okay, sure. Are you serious? My name's Ipanema. My dream is to open a cafe of my own someday. I've worked part-time at lots of cafes too. That's great. You must know a lot about how to run a cafe. Of course, and I'm here to help. Trust me, I swore to my heart to never destroy any other cafe ever. Oops. <laughs> I think that depends on the durability of this cafe. Okay, now that's settled. Oh. Yeah, I hope she's gonna clean up. Oh, she's gonna help me lift. This thing needs to get out of the way. Well, it's really heavy. I like the emotions on the characters' faces. Oh wow, she's so strong. Where should we put it? Yeah, their faces, their emotions are always so cute. I never imagined such a girl existed. Unlike that thieving youngster, she actually seems to appreciate cafes. This place is starting to get pretty lively. I hope things will get better soon. I hope so. Alright, so we've got two employees. More menu items. New menus may help the cafe's reputation. Take four of the same recipe fragments to Papi. Use the restore to make a new dish. Alright. So let's add the pancakes to our menu, shall we? And maybe I can make, I'm gonna make some pancakes for my dragon as well. Da, 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 da. 
Quite the party we've got in this cafe. Yeah, so so far all the characters are so interesting. So <laughs> yeah, definitely interesting characters. So we've got lots of we got three dishes here. Alright, and I am gonna make another pancake. It's kind of funny because the description of the pancake said like you can't go wrong with butter and maple syrup but the <laughs> the ingredients are just flour and sugar so there's no butter and maple syrup. More alive than Olive Town for instance. You know what this game reminds me of so far a little bit? It kind of reminds me of Epic Chef with like all the crazy like over the top characters. It kind of reminds me of that a little bit. You know what? Let's make another pancake. I played this once. It was cute for a one-time game. I see. Hopefully, hopefully I enjoy it for <laughs> more than one time. This game's art is interesting. Yeah, I love the art. That's definitely one of the most interesting part of this game. Is definitely the art style. So dish let's give some pancake to dry I don't know if you can feed him more than once a day actually and if so what does that ah yeah you can so I don't know what's the point like should you feed him more than once a day that's one thing I'm, I'm a little bit confused like should you feed like should you even feed your dragon um let's see what Ipanema has to say it's nice to meet you I'm going to work the best I can thank you so much Okay, so let's go out. There are still a few things I can do today, I think. Are you going to do more Epic Chef videos? I still need to know more about that screaming rooster. Yeah, I think I should stream it a little bit more. Um, I haven't played too much since last time, so maybe I should stream it maybe sometime next month. Gather ingredients. Ingredients are lifeline. No ingredients, no dishes. In order to have the cafe run smoothly, always keep ingredients well stacked. Oh, the range of exploration has increased. Awesome, awesome. So let's go... Yeah, these oh these are actually flying cats. I said the I said the birds looked like cats earlier, but actually I think they actually are flying cats. I only fed them when stamina was low, right? I think there's no need to like really feed them. Otherwise, why is it so dark all of a sudden? After you feed him, it showed his stamina bar filling up. Yeah, but I don't even know like what happens if the stamina is not like. If he doesn't have stamina, what happens? You can feed a dragon more than once, you might change the color of the dragon, I see. I want to play some epic chef at some point, but I think Arceus is going to eat my time until Rune Factory 5. Yeah, well, you've already played Rune Factory 5 a lot, right? But yeah, Arceus is definitely gonna be taking a lot of time for a lot of people. Hi Josh, hi Blue Elf, hope you're doing good. Alright, so now we should be able to go a little bit further here. Yes. Oh, and uh, I think there's some recipe fragment here. Yes, yeah, simple rice dish. Oh, there's something down here. So it seems like the world is pretty big, right? Thick noodle dish and let's see if there's any more like new fish here. I'm assuming like each fishing area is gonna have different type of fish. Like the first one near my house was just like sardine. Oh gobi. Sardine again. Sardine, all right, so I think it's mostly just sardine and gooby. I like our outfit. I don't think you can change like the outfit, but I think the character is pretty cute. And oh yeah, you can't go there until you can, you can fly. I can't wait for my dragon to grow up a little bit. I don't know if he's by the end of the stream, if we can grow him up like at least like one stage. 
So I've always got. I'm just missing one part for the simple rice, a simple rice dish recipe. I'm just missing one part. The fish you catch gets added to the net area near your house. Yeah, I know that. that. So that's pretty convenient. So you don't always have to go to like all the different places every day. Oh yeah, yeah so I got this simple rice dish. Now, wow, there's so many parts, so many, so, mu so much stuff to collect here. Is this early access or is it out? It is out. So this game actually came out in 2018. Uh, so <laughs> it's been out for a while, but a lot, I feel like a lot of people missed out on that game. Oh, I can't access there quite yet. I think I'm gonna have to wait until I can ride my dragon. Oh, another recipe. Alright, so we got a lot of recipes and I can't go here for now, so let's... Oh, you know what? Let me just pet, pet Macaron because I didn't pet him today. All right, like, I wonder if you pet him like twice, if the stamina is gonna go up. Yeah, yeah. So like, what's the point of cooking for him if you can just pet him like this? Like, what's the, you know? I I can just pet him multiple times. I guess there's probably a difference, beside the color that you can change. I don't know. So let's go see Pappy. Oh, let's pick up some manure. So I think you can get three a day. Oh, he's probably in, in mom's room. Satay and rice porridge and green salad. Oh my gosh, I got three recipes. I believe he gives fertilizer. Yes. Yes, the manure is used as fertilizer. So let's cook all of these new recipes and add them to. Uh, oh. Uh, maybe you need like chicken or I don't have the meat required for this so let's make uh, rice porridge let's make a sweet rice porridge I don't know if it makes actually a difference like which ingredient like if I pick salt versus oh Oh, he needs to eat to produce manure. Oh, I see. I see. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Oops. All right, so let's add porridge to this. And oh, we can add. Uh, for example, right now I have. No, wait. Yeah, for example, right now I have three and a half star pancake, but I can put a four star pancake instead. But it's gonna consume higher quality ingredients. I'm still not too sure how the menu for the cafe works, actually. I like, because I've never actually had, I, I don't know. Uh, so I can't make that quite yet. I'm gonna use good quality ingredients, spinach, carrots, the flavors will matter when the customers want variety on the menu. I see. Oh, do up, do up, do up. Meat you get from the wild bars. I see. All right, so we've got quite a few different things on our menu because it says like running out. So I'm always confused. Like, do I like? Do I need to prepare a lot of ingredients in advance or something? I'm not, I'm a little bit confused. Um, all right. So I'm sure there's gonna be a cutscene tomorrow with all of these new recipes. I think satay is made with lamb. Oh, I see. Once you serve customers, you will get a report on what they liked when you sleep. 
I see. Yeah, I didn't have to, like, I just served one customer for the tutorial, but I didn't really get to the actual, like, cafe part yet. So I'm assuming that's gonna come soon. Oops. Oh, you can use Dragon Manure even on this one. I think my fish is probably ready as well. The cooking reminds me of the little cooking game in Kingdom Hearts 3. I say I've never played Kingdom Hearts 3. I have the game, but I've never... I've never played the Kingdom Hearts series. I re that's something I really want to play this year. I need to find the time to play it, though. Okay, so tomorrow morning, that's going to be ready. And yeah, let's check our fish. These little 8 second tracks are almost... Some Soundforge prefab. <laughs> yeah, they're not the most unique. Not the most unique music, but they're pretty cute. But yeah, they almost sound like bot music. Like, not like original music, almost, kind of. So, oh, did he get something? All right. Oh, I think there's one more, one more bacon, and then after that we're gonna go to sleep. Little chef, the DLC lets you just skip those, which I ended up doing when I got tired of reloading after filling in and losing. Where? Oh, I didn't know there was a DLC for this game. Filling and losing rare ingredients. So, are there recipes that are really difficult at the end of the game? That's interesting, but I didn't know there were DLCs in that game. Alright, let's go to sleep. So there's probably gonna be some kind of cutscene. Oh, in Kingdom Hearts... Oh, I see. In <laughs> Kingdom Hearts 3, Little Chef is the rat from Ratatouille. Oh, I see. Mm. Alright. What should I do? Okay, let's go out. I was expecting some kind of cutscene today, but I don't think so. Hey guys, Josh here. Music to my ears. Oh, Justin, <laughs> I'm so glad to hear that. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good day so far. Alright, so I think our garden... Okay, let me pick this up. Yeah, there's definitely a lot of stuff. Lots of ingredients to gather every day. Getting lots of eggs. Like this. And then everything here. Lots of beautiful things. All right. Uh, oh, there's still more stuff here, I think. Check your quest in the menu. Oh, yeah, maybe I should do that, right? Uh, let's search for more recipes, and once we're done, let's get some sleep in. Oh, okay. So, I just need to find more recipes, I guess, right? Oh, the area cleared. So, yeah, I'm just gonna go to that new area, and we're gonna find the missing pieces for whatever recipe and then that's gonna make some progress in the story hey thank you for clearing the way sorry for the wait i got the tree removed thank you boy thank you guy thank you dude um all right that's good some carrot uh, i can go yeah, can't go there quite yet. 
I'll see if there's something around. Nothing here. Alright, there's some stuff. Oh, Dzuki Don! Oh, so that's where the Dzuki bacon comes from. A violent, violent, violent beast known as Zukidon can be found in the grass fields. Zukidon will try to tackle the player. They will eat a dish of yours if you are tackled. Oh no. Okay. I know your dragon can fight them later, but I don't know if my little baby dragon can do anything for now. Probably not. So I think he's probably gonna grow a little bit soon, right? Well, there's not too much he can steal from me, actually, I think, in my... Oh, yeah, I still, ha I still have a few dishes. You know what? Let me give some food to my dragon. All right, so I got one new recipe, which is probably... Yeah, I don't think... Yeah, I don't think I can attack him for now. So, okay, let's see if there's anything else. Lots of Zukidons. Little chicken. Oh, yaki bird. There are wild birds called yaki birds found deep in the grass fields. Yaki birds flee upon noticing you. If the player tackles a yaki bird, it will drop meat and run away. Oh, how do you tackle them? Oh, like this. So you just jump on them. Oh no! First, the <laughs> first kind of glitch, I guess. So that's meat that we just lose I was cleaning this just now but it's gonna take a little longer sorry but come back in the, another time everybody's cleaning in this in this world which is nice and okay let me try to go here ah! oh my gosh oh my gosh he ate two of my meals not just one. Oh, but at least so they kind of kill themselves, right? When they <laughs> when they attack you, I guess. Alright, so I'm gonna try to. No, I'm gonna go home. If they chase you, stand behind a rock and they kill themselves. Oh, I see. Okay, next time I'm gonna try to do that. Alright, so let's go to sleep. Let's go learn a recipe and then go to sleep. Hi Josh, enjoying the game, just got off work. Hi Morgan, long time no see. Yes, I'm really enjoying the game. Have you had the chance to play it too? But yeah, I'm really, really enjoying it so far. Bagna Cauda. Oh, I don't know what's that. Collect four recipes, fragment. Yeah, okay, all right. He tells me the same thing every time. As if I didn't know how to, how to do it. All right, let's sleep. Yeah, it's a really beautiful game, like the art style is very unique, and so far the dialogue and the story is interesting. And so hopefully we're gonna have some cutscene. I think so because there's a loading screen, so that means there's gonna be a cutscene. Everybody's so busy, except for Billy, he's probably slacking again. It's adorable. I pre-ordered this and played it. I love that you're enjoying it. Sorry I haven't been on these works being killer. No worries. Uh, yeah, I hope your work is doing good and you're not too, too, too busy. Hey, you're doing it again. There's no reason for you to be sitting down right now. I'm sure there are plenty. I'm not look. I might not look it, but I'm actually pretty busy right now. Let me guess. You're thinking about your life, right? I'm tired of hearing you say that. Think about the cafe. I'm glad you're scolding him, but I think it would be more helpful if you kept working instead. Oh, who's that? He reminds me of like Gourmet from the Harvest Moon games. I have a doctor's appointment in a few hours. Could you please tell me to get up and go shower? I'm feeling lazy. Well, you still have a few hours, but yeah, Emily, maybe you should go take a shower, Emily. And then maybe you can come back after your shower. This game looks so cute and cool. What game is this and what's it about? So the game is called Little Dragon's Cafe. 
and it's about running a cafe and there's lots of like interesting customers and you have to raise a little dragon and gather ingredients and yeah i've just started playing it and i'm really enjoying it so far it's on the switch ps4 and pc uh my word this is the most marvelous discovery what an adorable shop as you may have gathered from my appearance i love all things beautiful and cute this cafe feels rather nice it is the perfect respite for someone like myself. I had been searching for a secret hideout just like this one. Alas, there is no place so secret, so hidden that could obscure my magnificent charm. Sit anywhere you like. Oh, mm, which seat is worthy? Here. The seat was calling out to me. Please sit on me, it cried. <laughs> no menu? Extraordinary. I suppose this means you will be serving a dish best suited to my wonderful taste. I'm correct, aren't I? Mm, what should we make? Say, Billy. Go get him, kid. Ipanema? Not now. I need to knock some manners into this thick skull of his. Josh, it looks like it's all up to us now. All right, let's find something for him. A dish best suited to his taste. What should we make for him? He seems to have some pretty high expectations too. How about Bagna Cauda? I think he'd like that. All right, so let's do that. So, I need just three vegetables. I'm gonna make the best quality, so spinach. Spinach is... Uh, they're all like four stars, so maybe I should... Is it bad if I use just this... Oh, yeah, I think they want me to use the different ingredients. Yeah, so you can't use the same ingredients like three times. Oh, this one's a bit longer than other recipes. I think the more ingredients you have in your recipe, the longer it's gonna take to cook. I low-key hate the sun the dragon makes. Oh no, I think it's super cute. It's probably gonna change though. Once the, once the dragon grows up, I think the sun is probably gonna change a little bit. All right, so hopefully he's not too picky and he's gonna like it. Thank you for waiting. Here you go. Ah, uh, it was hardly a wait. Time stood still as I simply imagined you cooking especially for me. Such a gorgeous aroma, tantalizing. Allow me to taste this lovely dish. Oh my gosh, this game is makes this game makes me so hungry. Oh oh. Mmm, it's not bad, not bad at all. Yet this is not the handiwork of a true chef. Oh no. Well, we don't have a chef. I'm sure you can tell, but I've long desired to adorn the role of a chef. I have cooked quite often in the past. Oh, so he's gonna be our third employee. I have decided from now on I will be the chef of this establishment. Yes, what a fantastic idea. Did they change the music? So the music changes for every dish, or m some of them have the same one, but. Yeah, it changes depending on the dish. When are you gonna learn? Oh, oh she's she's super cyan again. <laughs> Come on, I'm just your average city boy. Working like this isn't really my style. You're not a city boy. Well, I am one in spirit, you know? Just go back to the village. <laughs> oh, yes, I just exude radiance when I'm cooking up dishes. Uh, okay, that sounds great. It is. I shine bright like a... You're gonna be seeing stars when I'm done with you. Yes, like a star. Once I become the chef, the cafe will overflow with customers coming just to watch me cook. All right, of course. Uh, can I get a little help? Yeah. Ipanema, please, let's talk about... <laughs> it's settled then. It's nice to meet you. My name is Lucola, and I really do look amazing when I'm cooking. Yes, it's very nice to meet you. Uh, Ipanema, let me demonstrate my favorite pose. 
Aha, what a ruckus. It's amazing to see how much has happened in the cafe. It may have been lonely for the twins at first, but it would seem that this is no longer the case. If everyone can work together, I'm positive they'll be able to save their mother. Go get them, kids. What an interesting cast of characters. Yeah, so far it's definitely my favorite part of the game is just like the, <laughs> the dialogue and the characters. Even though she's cute, I would fire Cyan, Karen <laughs> before Lazy Billy. Yeah, you know what? I think I would fire both if I could. <laughs> Billy, Ipanema, and the chef looks pretty good actually, hopefully. And the helper will take orders, serve and clean up. Lucola will cook the dish the customer orders. Players can help the staff members with taking orders, serving and cleaning up. It gets especially busy during the noon and night. Make sure to do your part. Staff members may become troubled, Lucola may fail a cooking dish at time, the other three will s The other three? I think I'm, I might be missing one. Uh, oh, maybe my sister. Talk to a troubled staff member or wait it out for them to return to normal. Alright, so should we wait until 12? I think today might be the first day where we actually get to do like the cafe stuff. Ah, uh, the sun is bright, but I'm shining even brighter. You know what? I like him. So let's go outside, pick up some stuff. Hello everyone. Hi, Indy Journey. Hope you're doing good. Sibling, Ipanema, and Billy. I see. Yeah, so your sibling. Hopefully my sibling doesn't lack as much as the other ones. I finally got to see alive. Hi, Slytherin. Hope you're doing good. Yeah, I decided to stream at a different time today to accommodate people in different time zones that can't like easily catch the usual streams, so I'm glad to see. There's actually a lot of people today. It's kind of funny because... Yeah, it's been a long time since there was that many people in a live stream, so... Maybe I should stream around this time like 3 p.m. more often. Who paid for all the broke dishes from the cyan? Yeah, I think she's cleaning up after after she makes a mess. After I, I think she's the one cleaning up everything. I hope so. I hope she gets the dishes back. All right, let's see if our fish is ready here. The awful stuff is probably the number one reason people hate this game because I know I hate that. You know what? They're kind of ho they're kind of awful, but kind of like they're charming, right? In their own way. Oh, did I use? Oh, wait. <laughs> that was kind of by accident. I didn't want to use the menu. Oh, is it ready? What? It's shiny, but I don't think. Yeah, I don't think it's ready. We hate it for the workers, but love it for the dragon and exploring for me. Yeah, the exploring is pretty cute so far. Yeah, dragon as well. Just stream when you're comfortable and are available. We can always see the VODs. Yeah, that's true, but... I like streaming with in, like, different times. Like, usually I like... Usually I stream around 6 p.m. EST just for, like, consistency. But I like to try different time zones as well. So let's go back to that area. Maybe it's been cleaned up since yesterday. They're honestly probably draining more money from the cafe than they make. <laughs> probably. Since he's saying it Super Saiyan, I guess he's more Super Magenta. What? Did I mispronounce Super Saiyan? Super Saiyan. 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 Is this from Marvelous? It's not from Marvelous. A lot of people are asking that today, actually. But it's from Yasuhiro Wada, who's, who was the producer of the first Harvest Moon games. And, like, I think he's been the CEO of Marvelous, but now he has his own company called Toybox Inc. So it's published by Toybox Inc. So it's not Marvelous, but it definitely has some Marvelous vibes to it. And it's definitely a Marvelous game. Like, in the sense of the word, in the sense that it is pretty beautiful and fun so far. I 
I say Cyan as Saiyan, oh, but I don't know if that's right. It's how me and my hubby said. I know, I've always said like Cyan, like Cyan? Saiyan? Saiyan? I don't know. I've never, actually, I've never watched Dragon Ball, so I don't know too much about Dragon Ball. Uh, so... <laughs> I, I don't know how to pronounce all the characters' names and everything. It's pronounced that way in Japanese, but in English, they went with Saiyan. Oh, I see. So someone said, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, Alas. So people say I should go between a rock, like... Like this? Oh, yeah. Like this, right? And they just kill themselves. Wow, what an easy way to get a lot of meat. Cyan or Cyan is the eternal debate. Yeah, well, I mispronounce a lot of things. So don't, don't rely on me for those kind of things. It's Sai, not Sai in Japanese. I see. So, Cyan, right? That's kind of like the Ghibli and Ghibli debate. Like a lot of like in Japanese, it's Ghibli, but a lot of English speakers say Ghibli, and like a lot of people debate like which is right, which should be which. So it's kind of the same, kind of the same thing, right? So all right, I'm gonna go. Okay, let me check. Oh, I can't make my salad. So, should I keep, should I remove, uh, well, let me try to go get some vegetables. Okay, I think I just need to sleep. Okay, let me get some vegetables. Uh, I think I should have some manure to let my stuff grow. Oh, I can't, oh. Yeah, running out of ingredients. Just you know a bunch of languages, I doubt any of us can complain about mispronunciation. Yeah, I know, but yeah. I much have a debate as to whether it's Josh or Josh? What? <laughs> Hi Josh. Hi Selina uh Selena, hope you're doing good. Alright, so yeah, let me pick up my stuff and then let's go sleep. Oh, I don't have manure. Maybe there might be some in the bed. In the dragon bed. Hi from Spain, this game looks awesome. Hi Raquel, 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 hope you're doing good. What should I do? Oh. Is she okay? Alright, so let's go upstairs. Let's go see if I have some manure. I am a new. I'm doing pretty good. Yes. Gamma is pronounced Yama, not Gamma. Really? Gamma is Yama. That's the first time I've heard that. I didn't. Oh, really? I'm gonna have to look that up. I'm interested in that now. I don't think I've ever heard that. Like Yama. That's interesting. Now that we have more staff members, I think it's time we increase the size of the cafe. Oh, I guess, but how? Just sit back and watch. Oh, so we get... Um, I didn't know we would have like upgrades like this in this game. Oh, wow. There's a whole new floor. Greek letter guy G is Y. Oh, I see. This game seems so cute. Can you get married in it? So there's no mar there's no relationships in this game. The cafe is bigger now. What do you think? With this much space, I'm sure you'll have plenty of room, even if you have guests over. Yep. Yeah, thanks, Pappy. Just I think you have to keep the food you found in the store. Yeah, it, it goes. I don't know what you mean, but it goes in the it goes in the storage automatically. The food, right? Uh, a third floor was added. Guest rooms are now available for those who wish to stay at LDC for a time. Every time I see LDC, I always think of DLC. 
Uh, the cafe will open shortly and depending on how well the staff works and customer feedback, the reputation will change. Improve the cafe's reputation to progress the story. All right, so we're finally gonna have some cafe things to do, I think, for the first time today. Okay, let's check out that new floor. Third floor. So gyro is gyro. Oh, that's interesting. I've never heard... That's the first time I hear that, but that's... I feel like I should have known that earlier. I feel like we should all know these kind of things. But we don't. Uh, so there's one room, two rooms. This one is locked. Alright. Oh, I, I didn't pet my dragon for a little while, right? Alright, so that's good. Okay, let me pick up the manure. Oh, maybe I need to feed him, right? I didn't feed him for a little while. Yeah. Okay, where's Macaron? Okay, let me go outside. I'm gonna feed him. I'm gonna cook. Yeah, let me cook something for him. The world Greek and Greek is Hellenica. The English term from Greek is from an old tribe name or something. I see. Sadly, with language comes different ways to pronounce things. I know I have a rough time with Spanish since I can't roll my R's, so my bestie teases me at times. Gyro is Euro. Gyro? Euro, so it's hard to type out sounds. I see. What kind of shows do you watch if you ever have time to actually watch stuff? You know what? I don't have I don't watch too many things. Uh oh wow, it's snowing so much outside. Um yeah, I don't watch too many things. Most of my time is spent either like playing games or making videos. So every time I do watch something, I'm just feeling guilty of like not making a video or not like <laughs> playing a playing a game. So I don't watch too much stuff. I have Netflix and I have like Disney Plus. So like if there's something I really need to watch, I really want to watch, I'm gonna watch like I, yeah, I really don't watch stuff a lot. So local amateurs as a cook from cooking, additional ingredients. For recipes are unlocked as Lucola gains experience. Using additional ingredients will allow you to make higher rated dishes. Lucola repeats repeatedly making the same dish will let you set the secret ingredient for that dish. This is containing secret ingredients may give you a dish a higher rating. Alright, 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 alright. So let's make some bagona cauda for my little dragon. Let's do this. Oh, I think... Yeah, I think that's a perfect dish so far. Yay! I always just went with it's all Melnix to me. What's Melnix? No one ever gets the reference. Yeah, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not getting the reference. i going to play Legends. It's definitely a different type of Pokemon games. Maybe I'm going to play it eventually sometime in my life. Uh, but I have so many games to play right now. And I don't know. I'm probably going to play maybe later sometime. But I'm not that interested in playing it right now. English really butchers spelling and sound of other languages. Yeah, definitely when words are imported from other languages to English, usually <laughs> they get butchered a little bit. Hey Josh, is the game My Time and Four Shiny Fun on mobile? Is it better than the Switch version? So it is fun because it's the same. I mean, it's the same game. But I think it really depends on your phone because some phones won't run the game really well, but for me, I think it's worth it. Like, if you don't... Like, for me, I don't like playing games on the mobile too much. Because, like, I have a laptop and I have a Switch. Uh, but if you if you can run it well... Like, actually, if you use the highest graphic settings, it actually does look pretty good. Oh, she gave me a recipe. Uh, it actually does look pretty good on mobile, depending on your device. Uh, yeah. Oh my gosh, they're all giving me recipes. Wow. Thank you, guys. 
And raise the cafe's reputation and check what's going on at the cafe at night. All right. So let me give some food to my little, loyal little dragon. Yeah, it's a lot cheaper on mobile as well. Nice to hang out with you on my lunch break with a bunch of good-looking food. Yeah, hope you're hope you're having a good lunch. Actually, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> I'm gonna have to eat something after this. One of my friends on PlayStation is named Flaming Cyan. Oh. Alright, so still maybe one more day for those. By second grade, all kids can read Greek perfectly, but Greek has 600,000 core words to learn. Chinese 100,000, Greek has a ridiculous amount of words, so in my opinion, Greek is harder. I see. Wow. I wonder how many words English has. That's a lot. That sounds like a lot. Oops. Yeah, I need to get lots of vegetables because I think I'm running out for the salad. Oh, the staff is slacking. Oh, also, okay, I want to see what happens when the... Like, I want to do the actual, like, cafe work. But I think I'm always out when they're doing it. Oh, yeah, it's happening now. The ingredients were stuck. Okay, so... Oh, darn, I'm cut. Okay. So, uh, what? Do I need to do something? Oh, yeah. Can I clean up? Alright. Oh, he's working. Good job. Good job. Good job. That's nice to see. So that that was it. That was the rush hour. Oh, sorry. I'll do it right now. Oh, she was slacking as well. So is there going to be more customers or I just have to come back at night? So I'm going to go back. I'm going to come back around five or six. I want to I want to actually work in the cafe. For English, it's around 170,000 words, apparently, according to the second edition of the Oxford's English Dictionary. I see. If the sister is sweeping, she's slacking. I see. That's good to know. All right, let's pick this up. There should be a later rush. Yeah, but are, are there customers in between the rush? The rushes or it's just during the rush that there are customers. Get some chicken. All right. Oh, maybe the area is cleared now. Let's check. Probably not because I think there's going to be some cutscene tomorrow. So it's probably going to unlock after. Later, you will have business all day, but still a lunch and diner rush. Oh, I see. That's nice. That's good. I think it might be open. Or maybe it's just because you can't see that far. Oh, I think it is open now, right? Yes. Oh, no. <laughs> it's not. Oops. Okay, I'm gonna get these little birds. And then after that, I'm gonna go back to the cafe. I don't know if the rush is at 5 or 6. Maybe it's at 7. This makes me want to go to the rest, like... This makes me want to go in a restaurant or in a cafe, but actually the... There's no dining right now where I live, so you can't, you can't go to the restaurant anymore. But... Yeah, I want to go to a little cafe and chill. Alright, so I'm just gonna wait until the customers arrive. I'm just gonna wait here with my sis. My phone's about... My phone's about Samsung. It should run pretty well. Yeah, I think so. 
Hello, I just joined. What do you think of the game? Hi, Phoebe. I'm really enjoying it so far. I've been playing for about two hours now. And so far, so good. It's really cute. The story and the characters are definitely the best point for me. But also the exploration is fun. The dragon is super cute. So yeah, I'm really enjoying it so far. All right, so let's wait. I guess maybe it's gonna start at 7 p.m. Let's wait. Take order. Place order. Take order. So you don't know what they want. Like they don't tell you like specific because I know I don't have the ingredients, for example, for the salad. So what, like, I don't know if that's a bad thing or I don't know. Yeah, that's quite busy, right? So I guess if you're faster, you're gonna get more reputation points. Ah, she's slacking. Oh, they're both slacking actually. Thank God Ipanema is helping me. She's the only one working. Alright, that was not too bad. Not too bad. I'm getting dragged into Monster Hunter Rise. Have fun with the game. Thank you so much. I hope you have fun with Monster Hunter Rise. I haven't played that game in such a long time. Uh, what type of device are you playing? PC? I'm playing on the N Nintendo Switch right now, but it is also available for PC and it's also on PlayStation 4. Alright, so good job everybody. That's good. So how can we see the reputation of the cafe? So let's see. Oh, so we didn't go up, right? Raise the cafe's reputation and check what's going on in the cafe. How come my reputation didn't go up? I feel like uh, I feel like I did pretty good, right? Hmm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure why it's not going up. Is it because is it because I can't make the salad? I don't think so. Oh, you can see reviews. The sunny side up is always tasting good. I'm gonna sleep good tonight. The sunny side up feels like it would wake me up. The sunny side up tastes like it came out of a dream. I want to eat it again. Um, I don't know what the, what I should do now. I don't know why my reputation is not going up. Talk to the customers and they will give you some stuff for cooking. Oh, I didn't know you could talk to them. Okay, I'm gonna sleep and I'm gonna try that again tomorrow. Oh, okay, so now the reputation. Okay, so it goes up at night. So I did okay, but I'm missing some carrots. I got 12 customers. All right. Oh, I feel like the color of my dragon, I feel like he's turning purple a little bit, right? Yeah, he's definitely turning a little bit purplish because I think I am giving him a lot of like uh, red food, like meat. And speaking of that, I need to give him some food. I feel like I gave him some food, but he didn't give me manure in a little day, in a little while. Wow, I have so much flour and so much fish. That looks so good. Let me add that to my menu. So you can 
I think you only have 10 dishes on your menu, right? And uh, maybe I should have something cold on my menu. So let's have some pudding. It definitely looks different. Yeah, right? I'm glad to know it's not just me. Oh, I love this music. Rich, very sweet pudding. All right. And so update the menu. Let's add this and let's add, let's cook. So when you add something to the menu, does it use it? No, it doesn't use it, right? Okay, so let me give this, should I, should I give him something red? Let's cook something red. Let's try to, to make a purple dragon. So, uh, wait, where do you see the color? I think you have to, I think this one's probably gonna be red, right? Yeah, you're still live. I had something to do. Hi, Fireblight. Welcome back. Yes, I'm still live. I'm gonna have to eat because uh, <laughs> maybe in the next 30 minutes or so because this game is making me hungry. But yeah, for now, for now, I'm here. And really enjoying... I really want to see my dragon grow up a little bit before the end of the stream. So that's something I really hope to see. Oh, there's no color for that. You know what? It's fine. Let's give it to the dragon. Hey Josh, is this joining your stream now? I had this blue dragon too, call them Sonic. Oh, Nike is cute. I was playing this game late last year after having it for a long time. I got to chapter four and got too bored. Yeah, hopefully I don't get bored. I'm enjoying it so far, but yeah. So let's see what we should do. Raise the cafe's reputation and check. Okay, so I need to raise the reputation again. So, Okay, I'm gonna come back around 12, but I'm just gonna collect some ingredients. I know I'm missing ingredients for the salad, so I don't know if that's affecting my reputation. I think this should be uh, almost... I don't know if I'm gonna have to wait until tomorrow or if I come back in a couple of hours, it's gonna be ready. Oh, yes, they are ready now, so we're gonna get a lot of good stuff with this, so that's good. And here. I just joined a few minutes ago. What does the cute dragon do? It's like a pet or something. You can go exploring with it. Yes, so the dragon grows up in this game, so eventually, like... For now, the only thing he can do pretty much is he can go into these little caves and pick up materials, ingredients, I mean. Uh, but later on, he's going to be able to fight, uh, fight some monsters, and you're going to be able to ride him as well. So as your dragon grows, um, you can unlock more things to do. And also, depending on what you feed your dragon, his color will change. So yeah, he's really, really cute. He catches, yeah, he can catches thieves as well. I think that's the most most important. Well, actually, I think I would have preferred for that guy to just <laughs> stay away from my cafe, but. Uh, so let's see if the path is open now. Probably not. But let's take a look. And I'm gonna make sure I go uh, back around 11 or 12 so I can help during the rush hour. Oh, yeah, they're still. He's still working on it. Okay, maybe I can get some of these. Ah, it's always stuck. The food always gets stuck, right?
All right, so let's go to the cafe. I really appreciate that you can teleport yourself to the cafe. That's very, very, that's a nice quality of life little detail. All right, so I'm assuming customers are gonna come in pretty soon. When the dragon gets bigger, he won't be able to go into the caves, will he? I think probably, he's probably gonna find a way. Maybe just like with his head or something. But I'm pretty sure. Because it's the only way to get certain materials, right? Oops, I need to... <laughs> I completely forgot to give the order. What are you doing, dude? Oh, there's two people at the same table. Yeah, these guys are all brother. I don't I don't know why <laughs> they left their older brother. He's sitting by himself. I got a lot of click clack rice today. Oh, it's kind of weird that yeah, <laughs> they come at a restaurant and they bring they bring ingredients to the restaurant. Oh, she's slacking. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't sit together. All right, that was pretty good. That's a that was a pretty good, pretty good shift. All right, I'm just gonna wait for this guy to finish his pudding. It can get into the caves. Oh, I see. How is it so far? I saw it was quite expensive. So I got it on fifty percent off on Amazon. So it was forty dollars for me. So I think it, it was worth it at that price, but otherwise the regular price is kind of a kind of an expensive game. But I think it's worth it. I mean I'm enjoying it so far so. All right, so I'm going to come back around 7 p.m., right? We can still eat out at restaurants here in the US. We just have to wear masks and social distance. Plus I'm fully vaccinated and got my booster. Nice. Yeah, here it's always changing, but so far like we went back to like, we can't dine in and like the gyms are closed and like everything. Things are closed again. But hopefully, hopefully this is the last time and things are gonna get better soon. I hope things are getting better. I think things are getting better. But, yeah. I don't know if there was anything left to collect over, over that way. Out of this game, hi, hi, Kifu Jimmy. Hope you're doing good. Glad you're liking this game. Did you finish it? I, I feel like a lot of people started to play this game but never finished it. Like they got bored like halfway through the game or something. So I hope you're able to play it all the way through. I think I might still do a few things we didn't collect on the other side there. And then after that, we're gonna go back, go back to the cafe. Oh, no, no, yeah, we can't go there yet. All right, so let's go home. I gotta go, need to get ready for work. All right, Annie, hope you have a, have a good day at work. Hey, we have customers waiting on there. <laughs> Please stop doing that. Why not? I know it would look incredible holding a frying pan. Me and this pan make a divine pair. <laughs> He's so cute. Listen to me, you need to hurry up and cook. The customer just left. Oh no. <gasps> a customer. I was looking at it in the Nintendo store and cringe at the $60 price tag. We'll wait for a sale. It was released in 2018. Did I see that right? This game looks tough. Yeah, it was released in 2018. I think it does look pretty good, but 
Now, if you don't get it on sale, it can be a little bit pricey. I did great for anyone who likes to complete everything. Oh, nice. Well, I'm glad to see that that you completed everything. Welcome. Oh, who's that little guy? Unique boy. Hey, come down, everyone. The great warrior Poncho is here. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. He's adorable. Mm, well, okay. Great warrior. Do you think this is a game? Mock me again and live out the rest of your days in infinite pain. What are you gonna do? Fling some pudding at me with that big scary spoon? Billy, that's enough. Poncho doesn't need that. He's a very cute warrior. <laughs> I don't think he likes being called cute. Yeah, a cute warrior? Oops. Oh, sorry. I guess cute wasn't where you <laughs> were going for. Warriors are supposed to be cool, not cute. I'm not a teddy bear. Oh, I am I'm a warrior in the middle of my great journey. I'm a strong man who's out on his own. Oh, he's crying. Let's take it easy there, Poncho. Why don't you have a seat? Oh, wait, sit down, you crybaby warrior. Do you need a booster seat? <laughs> Stop teasing me. Oh, poor little guy. Are you feeling better now? Let's pretend that never happened. Okay. Okay, I'm ready to order. Give me your finest juice. Any kind will do. Understood. Josh, can you make the juice for him? Yes. Yay, I was dying of thirst after journeying through the desert for so long. There's a desert around here. Thanks for the juice. That juice really hit the spot. I feel better already. So, what's with the spoon? Don't we <laughs> don't warriors carry swords? What an amateur. You think like a child playing pretend warrior. I uh, got this from a brave and legendary warrior in my village. I mean, I was imparted with it. The warrior I look up to, Taisho, imparted it to me. He's famous for eating and his symbol is this spoon. That guy's not a warrior. Oh, Billy, do you know him? No. If you don't know him, you can't say he isn't a warrior. You know nothing about him. All right, kid. What does the word warrior mean to you? Mm, well, you know, a warrior is strong and amazing, cool and... Uh, did I say cool? Go figure, coming from a kid. You're making up the story about how you got that, right? What? No! Um... Are you okay? What's wrong? My stomach! W where's the restroom? <laughs> Billy, that was way too harsh. He's just a kid. You didn't need to talk to him like that. That was cute. Phew, my stomach is sensitive, so be nicer to me. I'm sorry. My stomach had a curse cast on it when I fought against an evil witch a while ago. Now, whenever someone starts picking on me, my stomach aches. Is that so? Yep, the same exact thing happens to the legendary Taisho. It's just a sign of a great warrior, that's all. Yeah, I bet he gets an upset stomach because he just eats too much. How did you know? Lucky guess. <laughs> Fine, I came from the same village. <gasps> Seriously? Oh, okay, wait, so is Taisho... Kid, you should head home already. It's gonna get dark pretty soon. He's right. It's almost night time. Shouldn't you go home? Mm, well, oh, oh my gosh, sorry. My stomach, it really hurts. Are you okay? Oh, wee, it hurts. Wah, what to do? Oh. Josh, why not let him stay here? Here? This place is also an inn? Well, warriors stay at warriors stay in inns, so all right. I'll see the night with you. I'm sure you will feel safer having a great warrior under your roof. 
It's a little more reassuring when you aren't rubbing your stomach. I want to buy my time and Porsche on my Switch, but it's a little bit expensive and as the mobile version is much cheaper because they fix some bugs and stuff. Yeah, the mobile version is definitely good and I've heard the, the Switch version was improved, but yeah, it's also cheaper on mobile, right? Well, now we have a cute warrior in our midst, though I would assume his mother is worried sick now. Hmm, he looks like he has his reason, so I guess we can see how this goes, right? Does anyone have the same game on both mobile and Switch? I have it on mobile and PC, so I can't really speak for the Switch version. The satisfaction level changes depending on the customer's feedback on the dish. Raise their satisfaction level by preparing higher ranked dishes for them. Press the X button to open the main menu, view ingredients and dishes, and update the menu to be served to the customers. Wait, press the X menu to open the main menu. Check Dragon and Cafe stats and the guest story progress. Items gathered show the total number of items gained and staff condition shows the cafe state in three stages. Okay, that was a lot of stuff, but okay, let's see. Um, story. The a story of Taisho. Look and see how the cafe is doing tomorrow during daylight. Update menu. Poncho. So you can see the progress. So Poncho is the first like character. All right. So I don't know if Poncho is gonna. Maybe we can go to his room and see how he's doing. Oh, it's 6 p.m. now. Uh, let's see if he's in his room. Oh, maybe not this one. Oh, maybe... I don't know. I'm gonna go to sleep and see what happens tomorrow. Oh, at actually, there's gonna be the rush hour. Oh, yeah. I just I just joined in and I'm already impressed impressed by the art style. Yeah, it is a very beautiful game. Oh, it is getting kind of busy today, right? All right, like this. Oh, I think he's slacking, right? You see? Oops. Oh, you can cook? I don't know if you can... I don't think you can cook the stuff for the customers though, right? I think it's just for a dragon. Oops. Ah, she's pushing me around. Okay. Let's do this. Like this. Pick this up. Everybody's doing pretty good today. Like this. All right, that was not too bad. The environments are so playful. Yeah, I'm really a big fan of the kind of hand-drawn art style. It's really, really cute. Especially inside. I feel like outside looks good, but especially inside, I really like how it looks. So let's go to sleep. Let's see how he's doing. Oops, too, too late. Oh, some manure, finally. Gotta go, y'all. Have to pick up my brothers. Alright, Judith. Have fun picking up your brothers. And thank you so much for hanging out on the stream. So, let's see how our reputation... Oh my gosh, it didn't go, <laughs> it didn't go up as much as during the first day, right? How come? Just seven customers. Could you talk a little bit about what the game mechanics are? What's the main game loop? So basically you have people coming out your cafe. So a, a big part is just like the story and like meeting the different characters that come in the cafe. But the gameplay loop is mostly you go out and you explore, you, you gather some ingredients outside and then these ingredients are being used to make recipes that you're gonna serve the customers. And as your re reputation of your cafe increases, there's gonna be different people come into the cafe and your story will progress. And also your dragon will grow, which will allow you to explore more areas. 
Oh, hey, Poncho. Did you get enough sleep? You're not looking well. You're home s you homesick, Squirt? No, not at all. I couldn't sleep at all because I was out fighting bad guys all night. There was a little kid who was being attacked and when I showed up, he was overjoyed to the point of tears. You don't say? A little kid was being attacked out in the middle of the night? Enough about that, Billy. You're from Taisho's village, right? Tell me everything you know about him. Forget it, I don't know a thing. That can't be. He's a warrior who protects that village. He must be famous. Yeah, sure, within the village, but he never left. He never went out to see the world. I think Taisho is Billy, right? Probably. In the first place, what's the big deal over a hero among small town folks? You don't get it, do you, Billy? Whatever. Whenever you read from the chat, you seem to lean away from the mic and get harder to hear. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I'm trying to be careful about that, but yeah, that, that happens. Um, guests and story progression. Check each guest's story progression using the gauge. Listen to what dishes guests like and fix their problems with the power of cooking. So how can I see what he likes? I'm not too sure, I guess. Um, mm, 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 mm. Alright, let's go out. Let's go gather some ingredients. Alright, so let's... Pick up some stuff. Okay, mm -hmm. let's see if maybe the new area has been opened. Because I feel like here I'm always just getting the same ingredients so let's go over there oops one more oh I think Oh, I've never been here before. I just noticed that area. I might get a new recipe. Cold cocoa sweets recipe. Oh, maybe we're gonna learn how to make some hot chocolate or something. And we got a new fishing spot. Let's see if we get some... Mullet. Oh yeah, I think that's new. I got this game for $24 brand new on eBay recently. Oh, nice. Yeah, sometimes eBay is good for like... You have to be careful on eBay because sometimes stuff is expensive, but sometimes you can get pretty good deals on there. And new, that's even better. Alright, so I got one new type of fish, I think. And let's see if the area is cleared. This game really is cute, was just wanting something to watch while waiting on Pokemon Arceus. Usually my go-to for waits in between games, but you are making me want to actually buy this game. Oh, nice! Yeah, I feel like a lot of people missed out on that, even though it came out a few years ago. Like, a lot of people missed out on that game, so... Yeah, hopefully you can enjoy it and try it out and enjoy it as much as I am. Uh, I'm really liking this game so far, actually. So, yeah, so we've got this new area, lots of chickens, not chickens, lots of birds. I already have a lot of meat from these guys, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna bother too much with them, but maybe I can get some new recipe. Baked flatbread part one. Um, so there's not too much actually here. Oh, 12. Okay, let's go to the cafe. Let's go work a little bit. And I think after that, 
I'm gonna go eat dinner because I'm really getting hungry. When talking to a customer, they ask to have a dish to go. Upon serving that dish, they will give you ingredients in return. Oh, nice. Oh, so this one's gonna be to go, right? Maybe? Maybe not. That's right, I got a lot of click card press today. Thank you. I brought Zuki bacon. Thank you. I brought generic flour. You can have some. Thank you. Yeah, Billy's slacking again. Alright, so let's see what this little guy wants. I thought I could hear more about Taisho, but seriously, Billy doesn't get it, does he? I love salty food. Mom was saying that after I sweat a lot, I should eat salty stuff. So I don't know if... Like you... I don't know if I can make something salty for him or if I just like... I don't know. I'm just gonna give him this. I don't even know what that is. Alright. I think this was one of the first cooking type games on Switch. The system didn't launch with many cute, relaxing games. Right? There was not that many at, at the beginning of the Switch, you're right. There's a lot like coming out like last year and like this year, but in 2018, there definitely was not that many games in the genre. You can talk to them when they're slacking to make them work. Yeah, I know. It's just like most of the time when they're slacking, like I have something in my something in my hands or like I'm already busy so like if you carry a plate you can't talk to them but yeah even on my own I did pretty good right all right so let's go out for a few more hours All right. Oh, look at that big Zukidon over there at the top. Okay. Oh, I can probably, you know what? Would be a little bit more productive. I'm gonna use my dragon manure and I'm gonna go. Because actually there's not that much benefit of like exploring the same area twice. Because all of the things that you got, like if you got them once, you can just come back here and get everything you've had. So I think it's better to like just focus on this and get pretty much everything than like going out of your way to explore the same areas over and over again. Oh, and there's some new... Oh, I didn't know there was like new recipe stuff. New recipe fragments showing up on the shores. It's actually, yeah. Shrimp appetizer and shrimp appetizer and this should be ready I think yes so we got crayfish sardine mallet gobi gobi and I feel like I didn't feed my little dragon for a little while let's give him some pudding Good morning, Josh. Just woke up and see you streaming. Good day today. Hi, S. By you, I hope you're doing good. Unfortunately, you're kind of catching me <laughs> near the end of the stream. Um, so I mean, you can always watch the VOD from the beginning, but yeah, it's been two hours, fifty minutes. But if anyone's just catching up, I've really been enjoying this game so far. I gotta say, it's pretty fun. I don't know why I waited so long before playing it. Actually, it looks pretty good, right? With the sunlight, with the sunset. Alright, so let's go in and let's wait for the rush hour. Not the rush hour, the diner rush. And maybe I can cook a few things for my dragon. What should I cook? I want to cook something red, so I'm gonna make... I'm gonna make some steak ball. Oh, I think I can add a third ingredient now. I think at first it was just... I, I, I'm actually, I'm not sure. I don't think... No, I think... It, never mind. Never mind.
All right, so I'm gonna keep that for my dragon maybe tomorrow and now let's just wait for the customers to show up. Are you playing on a PC? No, I'm playing on the Switch. So that's the Switch version of the game, but it is also available on PC and PS4. Is there any romance or marriage? No, so there's no like really relationships. Um, there's lots of interesting characters, so you get to meet lots of characters and know more about them. Uh, but there's no romance in this game. Oh, I love how he, he's actually using the booster seat. At first he said he didn't want to have a booster seat and he was crying, but now he's actually using one. That's kind of cute. The steak bowl doesn't taste bad at all. Yeah, he's always ordering that. Oops. Oh, she found a recipe fragment. Oh, maybe I should talk with my employees a little bit more often because they actually... Yeah, they actually can give you stuff. It's weird because it's always like, <laughs> at the beginning of the game, there's not too many different customers. So it's always these three brothers, but they never sit together for some reason. This game kind of reminds me of that chibi style Harvest Moon game for GameCube, same kind of vibes. Yeah, Magical Melody, right? Yeah, I see what, I mean, they're kind of different, but I see the, I see the similarities a little bit in terms of like atmosphere. I really like Magical Melody, it's one of my favorite. So let's go to sleep and I think that's gonna be it. I really wanted to see my dragon grow up, but I need to go eat something. But let's see how much progress. Oh, satisfied. So today was a pretty good, oh, it's still <laughs> not going up very much. Maybe I should make something more salty. So I have the rich, slightly salty steak bowl. Maybe I, I should try to find a, re a recipe that's more salty for that guy. And is it worth it in 2022? I think so. So yeah, if you guys have been like me, you've been waiting on this game or like just you found it expensive or anything like that, or you were scared because a lot of the reviews say the game is buggy and things like that. I think it's worth it. So far, I mean, I've just been playing for three hours, but so far I've really been enjoying my three hours that I've had with this game and I definitely will continue to play it more. So for me, I think I've got, considering I got it at 50% off, I think I got my money's worth with this game. And even on the Switch, I think it does run pretty well. So I would say go for it. If you've been waiting on this game, you should get it. And like the characters are all so interesting. Like if you want to play by yourself, you shouldn't watch too many streams of this game. You should just like enjoy the story like by yourself so there's no spoilers. Because I think that's an interesting part of this game. What's wrong, Poncho? Couldn't sleep again. So I'm just gonna go through this cutscene and then that's gonna be it. It seems one of the brothers has a set with the other two. It's always two and one, right? Yeah. Apparently this was made by the guy who made Harvest Moon in the first place. Yes, yeah, so this was made... This was produced by Yasuhiro Wada, who... Um, he he also produced the first Harvest Moon games. So, uh, yes. He's probably homesick again. That's not it. Last night there was an old lady walking in a storm all alone and I went to help her out. When I carried her luggage, she was overjoyed to the point of tears. Hey, Josh. How was the weather last night? Um, I don't know, I think <laughs> it was no storm. You think I'm lying? Oops. Well, okay, let me have it. Yes, I'd like to see that too. It does sound quite interesting. Mm, you ask for it. Watch me use the spoon and my stomach. Oh. Okay, don't overdo it, kid. Let me show you how to really use a spoon. Look a lot. Curry me. Cur curry me. One curry coming up. A warrior's spoon is way different from a regular spoon. Is your spoon handcrafted? Well, it's... I took it from the sign in front of mom's store. Your mom's store? Is it a restaurant? 
Pretty much, she owns a bar. I took it because it looked like the perfect spoon for a warrior. Wasn't your mom upset about you taking the spoon from the sign? No, she just smiled. She said that I would grow up to be a fine warrior. My mom is taking some time off work right now, but I'm going to protect her as a warrior. Ah, oh, that curry looks so good. I present to you curry. Take note, kid. I'll show you how to use a spoon. <laughs> Sadly, there's no romance or marriage in this game, but there are plenty of cute farming types games that not only have romance and marriage, but also same-sex relationships. Yeah, I think, I mean, I don't think you need romance in all all games, right? So I think, I think the way it is, it's perfectly fine. You just wanted to eat curry, didn't you? Hey Josh, have you still been playing Breath of the Wild? I haven't played Breath of the Wild in a little while. Alright, so that's gonna be it for today, guys. Uh, I'm gonna be looking forward to playing this game more. Uh, maybe once I've finished it, um, I might do a review of something or something if you're still undecided. But I think it's a pretty fun game, so I think you should get it. And I think you will enjoy it. At least I'm enjoying it, so I'm speaking for myself, but I am enjoying it. And I don't see all the issues, but I mean... I've just played three hours, but so far I'm liking it. So that's gonna be it. And does it save automatically? How do you save? I think, oh, I think it probably saves when you sleep, right? Probably. Let's see. Oops. Return to title. Can you imagine if I lose all my data? I think it probably saves when you sleep, right? Oh yeah, load game. Playtime, 2 hours, 37 minutes. Really? Okay, yeah, so, okay, yeah, that's the same. Okay, so you start in the morning again. When you sleep. Alright. Alright, thank you so much, guys. I'm gonna go eat, because this game made me hungry. Alright, okay, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next live stream or next video. Bye-bye.